Midlight City. One of the last ultra cities. A sprawling metropolis standing alone against a backdrop of utter devastation. Nestled at the foot of a volatile volcano or a silhouette of smoky neon. The damned days are etched deep into Midlight's memory. When the city fell into chaos following the great eruption, political subterfuge and corporate greed led to complete societal collapse. Midlight City has since splintered into sovereign districts, each a stylized testament to the corporate power struggles and gang wars that shaped it. Skyscrapers now stand as dark overlords, their hollow windows staring down at the lawless streets, urban veins pulsing with anarchy and desperation. Yet, amid the uncertainty and despair, is an opportunity to rise above the chaos, to grasp power and with it the fleeting chance of a better tomorrow. Some dare to venture outside the city's protective wall, known as the Edge, and seek their fortunes in the perilous scorched lands. Others choose to stay within, navigating the endless power struggle. Only the most cunning rise from the ashes of the old world to claim their place in the new. For the rest, survival is a daily battle. But in the heart of Midlight City, even survival is a victory. There it is. Hello. Hello, hello. Welcome to Shadows of Raconia, our weekly main show. Uh, I'm Matt, and I'm <laughs> going to be your GM, because and you're stuck with me now for the rest of the month. So good luck <laughs> with that. Yeah. This ah. is Midlight Madness, uh, episode one of four, our Cities Without Number game. Uh, and we're going to have a lot of fun. And to my left is this guy. Yes, I am Yuri. I am playing Damon Piltover. Bar manager extraordinaire, ex corper. Hi, I'm Sarah. I'm playing Tai Lin, cyberdoc, healer, medic, also ex corper. Mm. And I am going to be playing Jubei, Murabasa, the street samurai, the street ronin, and. He is gonna redeem himself for the set, for the the shameful display he made last time. Jubei, I keep trying to tell you we won that fight. No, it was shameful. My name is Brick. Mm -hmm. That's all. Okay. Well, all uh, I see there's a lot of foxes in chat. Hey, Tater and Gibbs, the loot. Uh, all right. I guess we'll just jump right in. This is cyber. Oh, I should do an announcement. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh, yeah, yeah those, yeah, those yeah, things. Yeah. Announcement. I'm not uh, really brick. Uh, I'll be Steve for it's a little announcement. bit. Stuff like um, that. So we have a Discord channel. Uh, if you or a Discord server, if you don't know it, please come to it. There is a link uh, below the video if you're watching on YouTube, uh, and uh, somebody maybe will put it in the chat uh, on Twitch. Um, I don't have the button set up right now. Is this YouTube? You said YouTube. Uh, I'm talking about Discord, but oh. we also have a YouTube channel. If you're watching us on Twitch right now, you should be aware of our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Shadows of Arconia, where you can see all the back episodes of this show, uh, of our Worlds Without Number game, and uh, of all of our games from Monday night, uh, where we do Tales from the Backlog, where we try out lots of different I games with a too. rotating cast of players. Um, we're currently in the middle of Call of Cthulhu, Run by this dude. Yes, sir. Right here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Currently Captain. trying to hide in the shadow <laughs> despite being directly under 18 light bolts. What if I'm, I do a I'm, major? I'm channeling Carolyn right now. Well, I know she appreciates it. <laughs> and I feel it every time. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, I feel like this is the Carolyn Merch seat. store. Merch store. Yuri's wearing one of our merch t-shirts hey. right now. If you lift up a little, your name tag won't block the logo. All right. <laughs> I have everything. I'm, I'm kind of short, so. Yeah. Um, <laughs> they're not my players tonight. They're my comrades. 
uh, yeah, so we have a merch store, shadowsofarconia.com. You can get t-shirts, you can get sweatshirts. Used to be able to get a mug, I took that down. But uh, what else we got? The throne wish list, throne.com slash shadowsofarconia. You can help us buy more gear to help improve the quality of the stream. You can also help us with that by going to Patreon and supporting us on a regular basis. Yay! Uh, Patreon tier starting as low as $1 a month. So come check that out. Uh, and yeah, that's it. We'll see you Monday for Call of Cthulhu. What else we got, Matt? Um, I think you covered everything, right? There we go. Did you credit? Did you talk about your art? Do you care? Uh, no. oh, okay, great. I'm trying to buy myself more time to get the pressure off me a little longer. So, uh, all of the character <laughs> portraits in front of our players tonight are done by yours truly. I work in Dad's studio. I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram as Mighty Works Character Portraits, and on art station under my real name steve boshier which is not on screen tonight but if you look at any of our other episodes uh, where i'm in that chair it will be that chair uh cool so a little warning i haven't played this game in like or we haven't played this game in a couple months now so hopefully everything makes sense to all you guys we should be all right on the rules because the Warm same rules as the other yeah game. pretty much yeah but, all right yeah if i get the npc name wrong don't kill me don't crucify me all right so in the la latest episodes of our cyberpunk saga, unfolding in the anarchic mega city of Midlight, the operators from the notorious kill count found themselves entangled in a web of danger and deceit. Tasking, tasked by their employer Mox of the Shockwave Combine to destroy secret cargo from a Dan aircraft in the treacherous Lost Lands, the newly formed team ventured into the perilous territory. During their mission, the operators obtained the cargo, but against uh, blah, blah, blah. against mission parameters, uh, they wait. What? No, no, I, I lost my spot. We opened the crate. Yes, you, you opened the crate. We opened that crate that you were not supposed to open, and uh, nope. inside found a incubated fetus labeled Y14. Uh, altering the course of their already risky endeavor. Uh, after rescuing the unknown entity, the team pressed on through a series of daring missions, including a harrowing confrontation to reclaim Brick's stolen pride and joy, Queen Granda, from the clutches of the Warheads gang. Amid, amidst clashes with the Primals, also known as the Legendary Ermine, uh, the Warheads, or and the Warheads, the operators Resilience and unity were put to the ultimate test upon their return to Kill Count headquarters. A sudden ambush by a van armed with a menacing minigun threw them into a deadly showdown. And that's where we're going to begin tonight. So you guys, where we left off, you had arrived back at your club, the Kill Count. Um, it's evening now. Uh, you... As you left the vehicle and started walking towards the door, I believe Mana was asking, or mentioned that uh, you guys have been through a lot, just by your appearances. Then you were taking a phone call from Mox, where he was like, hey, are you guys back yet? Um, I have a guy inside who's going to pay you for the, the last job. Um, and I'm not going to replay the whole conversation again, but in the moment, you started to sense something a little off about how eager he was to pay you guys back uh and also in that moment um you ever get a feeling when when something weird is, is happening or something doesn't just doesn't feel right and everything started starts to kind of like your senses almost heighten a little bit um a van starts to pull up adjacent to you guys uh, a door slides open, and can I get everyone to roll me a notice check? You get a plus two because of that phone call. Okay, here we go. Oops, sorry. I rolled an eight. Is it 2d6? Yes, it's 2d6. 2D6. Okay, it's been two months. Can I add my hearing modifier to this? Uh, yes, yes, you can. So then that would be a 10. Uh, with my modifier, that's gonna be... 
<laughs> Carlos is like, I got the rule book open. Trying to remember. Someone needs it. <laughs> Thanks, Carlos. We'll Thanks, probably Carlos. need it. I'm going to just, just remind it. myself the, the basic mechanic of the game. Uh, it's going to be a nine from me. Can I add an attribute to this? Um, That's with an attribute. For, oh, for a notice check. Yeah, I didn't yeah, have my yeah. attribute. You'll be... It's, uh, so it's not intelligence five, it's or wisdom either. Yeah. It's four. You went down. I went down. <laughs> I'm not great at a lot of things, but oh, wait, I sure I can might, drive. I might actually have a, I, I might actually have penalties to this. Nope, I don't have penalties. But Did you say your penalties? Four. Oh, okay. Sorry, I was waiting on yours. I didn't realize you said it. Uh, okay, great. So, um, so for you are talking to Mana, uh, so your attention is yeah. more on that and. What you see is actually, because you're looking at Mana, yeah. and you see her eyes widen. And she takes the table with her, her tarot cards and flips it towards the street. And like it's almost slow motion, like the tarot cards are going through the air. Uh, and she ducks down behind it. Okay. Uh, um, Jubei, you are walking and you notice... Uh, oh, let me roll for Max real quick. I have no idea what... Or, um, Archie. Archie, thank you. Oh god, he actually got a nine on the dice. He sees it. Yeah, so he would know too. Um get rid of this actually. Jubei, you're walking, and it's deep in Edge City, where it's just buildings. There's probably not a plant around. Um, but as you're walking, you you notice ahead of you up on a telephone pole. Um, or a light pole, uh, a bird. And it's a very, it's actually a very beautiful pattern and everything. We know them as pigeons, but it's like the pattern on this pigeon is really beautiful. And it starts, it suddenly just gets startled and starts to fly away almost in slow motion. Uh, John Wooish, one might even say. What? I said John Wooish, one might even say. Exactly. Uh, Brick, you... So I had a couple ways I wanted to go with this with you. I think, tell me if I'm, if I'm wrong, but you're still, like, taking your hand along the truck. and Yeah, also, like, I'm trying to slow the heart rate because I've just been more pissed off than I've ever been in my entire life for, like, three mm -hmm. hours straight. Yeah, yeah, you've been through a lot. So you're trying to center yeah. yourself. Um, uh, Damon, though, you happen to be like you're turning to, t to talk to everyone about the phone call you just had and you happen to be looking right at the van mm. and notice the door slide open uh so i'm gonna give you one turn to do some one thing an action or a move before they get their surprise round mm. No do do I see anything like you see, sliding out? Yeah. Oh yeah. When the door slides open, you see a, a armored man. You think it's a man? It's mm -hmm. got a, a helmet with like glowing eyes, with a mounted heavy Gatling gun or minigun. Oh, you said it was two. It or it's, it's two. Ooh. Yeah, double barreled. With a it's Gatling. one gun. Now. So I'm going to yell out to the group ambush and then i'm going to make to pull out my smoke grenade i think i still have one left from the last session Ooh, okay and i want to throw my smoke grenade towards the van oh wow that's nice that's really, nice. really good do it uh good thing i had three months to think about it well <laughs> <laughs> yes we've all been planning this for three my months. gosh okay uh i think you just make a so I'm, I'm, I'm the cyberpunk, uh, red way of throwing a hand grenade might is, is what I'm thinking of, and I'm, and I'm blanking on this way of throwing a hand grenade. Give him the Carlos. Chair. Carlos, what do you got in smoke grenades? There's a delay there. We can't count on Carlos every <laughs> I know, time. I know, right? He's gonna look it up. Uh, so it's a, deck, a dex check. I think, yeah, I think it's a, a skill check. Let's just do a, a skill dex check for now. Okay. Uh, and Didn't it will go out. It's just. How much it? Well, it's a ten meter uh, concealment. Um, it doesn't. If you have IR or um, augmented visuals, it doesn't affect you. Copy that. But otherwise, it's you can't see things. Okay. Well, I'm just trying to make sure you land it in the right spot. 
thing you have to do is prepare. Mm-hmm. Still don't know how to throw it though, right? <laughs> uh, <laughs> you you know, I'm, Damon's an underdog. He has negative modifiers. Uh, that's true. <laughs> okay, we can use the exert or shoot. According to Carlos, exert dexterity based exert. Um, I have nothing in exert, so that would be a minus to my roll. Here, let's oh, yeah. bring up the thingy. What do you say? I'm really just making sure you're not going to miss, you're not going to be out of the 10 meter range. It's not a far throw, so. Okay, that is an 8 minus 1 is a 7. Uh, so you are off target a little bit, but not enough to, uh, you're still within the 10 meters, so it will block the gunner of the van. Uh, but I need to look up, because I didn't write down this guy's, in my, my paper notes, I didn't write down his um, augment. I need to make sure he doesn't have the ability to see through smoke. I'm pretty sure he doesn't, but I just want to double check. So at this moment, though, yeah, can you look up your that's your action. You use your smoke grenade. It it explodes uh just as the uh the gatling gun starts firing um everyone go ahead and roll evasion um so this is an area of effect attack basically uh it's suppression and i don't think yeah so it's not they don't even have to roll an attack so i'm, I'm trying to figure out all I'll so give you all partial cover for the smoke. So you can add a, a, a plus two to your rolls. Oof. So that's a saving throw, right? Yeah, evasion saving throw. A d6 or a d10? Well, <laughs> Nat 20. Two, I, well, yeah, you were looking right 20. down the barrel. So First time I don't roll a one, you guys. So as the minigun goes off, the percussion oh. and the the la the sound of this thing is so massive that the smoke even kind of billows out from the the smoke grenade, and you guys can feel the wall of heat and and sound hitting you as these bullets just start, like snapping past you guys and ripping into the wall like debris mm -hmm. just going absolutely everywhere. Um, I'm sorry. What did you get? Really bad. Uh, so that's going to be so my special gift penalty phase is in. So I get negative one to my physical save. So that's going to be three, and then add plus two for the bonus, plus two for my plus one for my deck. So that's six. And so yeah, against my evasion save of ten. So yeah. Uh, uh, do I that's get? Wild. Yeah. So you. I'm sorry. So you. She failed. I failed. Failed, failed back. Great. Failed Great. real bad. Did you pass? Yes. Okay. But Ooh, that's a. This seems like a great time. Yeah. To implement my new. Uh... I would highly recommend it because they rolled really good on their damage. Yeah, I'm gonna implement my third edge, my fifth level edge of veterans luck, and use that up for this scene and say, oh, that actually missed me. <laughs> so even though this thing is firing at almost 3,000 rounds a minute, yeah. somehow. Like, you're, there's bullet holes <laughs> yeah. in your clothes right now. Somehow. That flip, like, when I saw, like, if there's one thing I know how to do, it's when, it's when to duck. And Mana's table flip was like, nope, flat to the ground. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, great. So they, anyone who failed will be taking 17 damage. <laughs> I'd be dead. Anyone who <laughs> passed, is ta is uh, taking half that. <gasps> I am. Did mana make it? Uh, don't worry about mana right now. <laughs> what's, what's happening? She brings good business to my bar. Do I have any uh, opportunity to put myself between my comrade and comrades and the guns? Uh, only. Half of 17 is going to be, is rounded down? Yeah, or, sure. It'll be yeah. eight then. Oh, yeah. eight? Yeah. So, yeah, I'm So what did that do to you guys? Like, where are you? Where are you? I had 11 do I soak HP left. With my... Uh, your armor, oh, by the way, your armor is refreshed. You do soak five. Okay. Believe, some of you guys have five and some of you have two armor soak. my mm -hmm. soak here? I have soak of two. Yeah, my, so I soak five. Yes. So that's good. So yes. I'm only at, I only lose three points instead of eight. I also soak five. I am at 10 out of 13. 
I love Carlos. He just is like, he's just so, just, even if we don't need it, he's putting all of the rules. Like, he's like, the rule you're referring to is page 58. And I'm like, oh, that's awesome. I, no, that's good because even if we don't need it, like other people watching are yeah. like, getting that. Yeah. Absolutely, dude. It's so cool. We appreciate you, Carlos. Yeah, you're great, man. Thanks. Awesome. So let's go ahead and roll initiative. So I'm at eight. Now. Oh, initiative is. Does the armor depict do, do, do. one point shock, right? Uh, no. Uh, it uses up. So your soak is. It's the eight. Is your soak at five? You had five armor yeah. soak. You 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 subtract five from the damage you just took, and that and then your armor's gone. Until until the next scene? theme. Yeah. yeah. I rolled a two. Okay. It's all the way over there. I can't reach it. Ooh, what are you looking for? One or two? I rolled a one. Eight, right? On my die. Yeah. All right, I got it. Can't use the dry board if it's wet. Plus dex? Mm hmm. Uh, seven. It's going to be three for me. Oh, it's it's a d8, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You got seven? Se seven. No, oh, that's going to be low. Ooh. Damon's probably last with the roll of two. Oh, you have a prodigy at dex. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Did you have this out on purpose? Nope. It must have been me. Okay. You got 10? Yep. Because I'm a prodigy. A dex. Garanda, if you're alive, you should roll initiative too. Garanda's not alive. Garanda's an object. She could be an oh. AI. Garanda, wake up. Garanda, wake what up. What did you get, uh, Brick? I got three. Oh, shit. I keep forgetting Max. Yes. Uh, He needs evasion real quick. Man, I wish I had his character sheet. Well, his evasion is going to be 16 minus his level uh, minus his dex. So it's going to be... I'm just, I'm just going to give him a 10. At most, just it's going to be a 10 or he's 11. He's dead. Yeah. Okay. He falls. He's dead. Uh, he got 16, so he's taking he's 8 gone. damage. Yeah. Yeah, dead. so he'll... You, I think you gave him 10 HP last time. So he's down to 2. Sure. If he was down I did. Yeah. I'd have to look. I'd have to watch the video. I, I, I know I, I brought him I, back, he had but no I don't remember armor how silver? many. And I'm sorry, I asked you, uh, what three. was three? Okay, perfect, I put your name Max right Max had no armor soak? Uh, you're right, so he's down to five. I don't know if you guys can read that on stream. Probably not, I don't no, know. Not really. But it's there. Yeah, but it's there for us to look at. Uh, it's so there if you want to zoom in and enhance. It'll be Jube, Ty, Brick, Damon, and then the Gunners. Mm. Oh, and mm -hmm. freaking Max, or uh, Archie. Uh, Archie. Max, why aren't you here? He got a one on the dice, so he's gonna go a little last. Uh, he's probably two anyway, but for some reason his wife didn't want to spend her birthday waiting for Max to come home from the game. <laughs> <laughs> I'm selfish. So... <laughs> you get you get another birthday another next year. Yeah. So not like Mine, just only kidding. Born. Just kidding. We love you, Max's wife. We love you, Max. All right. <laughs> I'm not kidding. <laughs> all of I'm that all of that is right. is settled so uh let's continue with the fight jubit you are up uh all right so jubit sees where that uh where that fire came from it's on top of a car that one uh it's yeah that, that one's representing the um <laughs> it's a van. van with a sliding door right? yeah yeah so it's a blackish grayish or more like a grayish van dark gray but this this is it for Tabletop purposes. Yeah. Right. Jubei calls down the lightning. He spends uh, one action and his system strain to launch uh, a violent range of strike against the target up to okay. 60 meters away. Yeah. And uh, attack range is five meters impact and 2d6 energy damage. So you have to roll to evade. Um, Are you targeting the car or the guy on okay. top? The guy on top. So he, well, he's on the inside. Um, if I'm gonna rule that you can only attack the car because they are inside the car, and the lightning's coming from the above. But he's in front of an open sliding door. If the lightning's coming at even a slight angle. All right, here. Let me. On your side. Uh, yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Actually, describe how you do the attack. Where the where you decide, you tell me where the lightning's coming from. Describe the attack, and then we'll resolve that. Well, um, you hit the car either way. Yeah. Um, it's just whether or not they get. Hit. It's kind of like um. 
Are you shooting it from your sword or, or calling it down? See, this one it says, draw the power of thunder and lightning from your blade. Oh, great. So, so it's like he... Yeah, okay. So, so you he, won't get the driver. He kind of does like a weird like circle like this, nice. builds up the energy and just oh. throws it. Mm -hmm. uh, oh wait, no, it's supposed to be an evasion, not 2d6. Natural 20 on the evasion. So he's only going to take half damage? Yeah, it's half damage, yeah. Cool, what'd you get? Uh, it's out of... I rolled 8. 8 damage. Oh. And... What about, what about the other guy? Did he... Uh, driver does not get hit. Okay. Uh, but the gunner does. Gunner does. Yeah. Okay. Which is the, you know. So he takes eight. Great. Nice. Uh, and, and also, gunner, he has saddleware, right? Yes. So he's mm. stunned for one round. Because mm. I hit him. Wow. Uh, okay. I'm going to do. So the guns are going to continue to fire, they're just not going to be aimed. So I'm going to do a luck roll okay. on... Or actually, I'll have it's each like, of you do a luck save to see if, it, if yeah. you even get Any target wearing cyberware that, that failed the evasion also is stunned for one turn. Oh, he didn't fail the evasion. No, you said the gunner failed. No. No, he, he, he got a natural 20. That was the driver. The driver doesn't get hit at all. The driver doesn't get hit at yeah, all? Yeah, he didn't even roll a save. Okay. So he's not stunned. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Sorry, it's been a long time since I, I read that. Uh, great. And then, uh, so, and then Jubei gets to cover behind Granda. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um. Further? No, know? I'm just checking the arc here. Well, I'm asking Alan. You were you were like there. Do you yeah. want to go further? No, that's good. Okay. Great. Next up, Ty. So just so you guys know, the, it's a sustained fire. So as you guys are doing this, the, the, the bullets are coming in and they're chewing the wallet behind you. Yeah. Uh, it's almost too loud to even talk. I will pull my... You know what? I'm going to move and I'm going to go for total defense. Uh, I'm going to, as my main action, I am... Uh, there is nothing I can really... I don't even think it's worth it to pull my, my gun and shoot. You're running behind the truck, too? Yeah. I'm going to move behind the truck and go for total defense. Awesome. Probably smart. Yeah. Uh, brick. The Queen. brick her. Ram that van! Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, <right>? Yeah. Ha. <laughs> uh. You would do this to me, wouldn't you? It's not like I didn't tell you several times. <laughs> like I actually listened to stuff. You said. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, yeah, yeah. That van is gonna hit that car. That truck. The truck is gonna hit that van. You know, something like. Yeah. That. Okay. No, this is great. I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, uh, Ghost driver for the win. Yeah. Or the, or the two six right? Yeah. You want me to do mine or or just unmodified? It's just a, it's unmodified. If your save, well, it's not a save. Uh, it's a drive check. Oh, I'm sorry. You're right. You're right. Dex drive. Um, unmodified because you're not. It's it's they're not a stunt driver. But it's seven. Really, what? Seven. Uh, tied. So. Well, they're not moving. And if the driver out. wins, the target must make an evasion save. The vehicle's maximum HP. Uh, I would say Ty goes to the defender. But no. Game, right? Well, I mean, they're not moving, though. So logically, how would they? Mm. Oh, you're right. Oh, they got a minus four to that, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. God, yeah. this is so complicated. Uh, when the driver skill... The eight, this AC is increased by the driver skill. Okay. Great. Let's... The ramming vehicle also takes so damage. There's PCs when tied. All right, fine. We, we, you you, you already won no matter what. Um, so yeah, yeah PCs when tied. Now we just need to figure out damage, though. Oh, uh, God. <laughs> <laughs> and shove. And like, uh, yeah, knock back. Okay. And... Guys, we're playing It's Pirate not super clear. It's actually, the, here's what's confusing. This paragraph with the ramming description, it's very specific on how I ram a person on their feet. It gets super vague at the end with how to ram another vehicle. 
Um, so that's the that's the confusing. Part. I don't know. If you, well, this would be like a vehicle crash. Okay, so I'll uh, do whatever you say. Right yeah, yeah. So what grenade. dice is everyone using today? Mm -hmm. I picked up this nice shiny metal one. I don't know whose it is. Oh. It's just in the tray. I'm using Max's dice. I'm <laughs> using the ones that came in the drawer. Because I nice. have to play for him. <laughs> <laughs> yes, my regular dice are actually in that box right behind Alan. So that's my, that's my box. It. I can, I can I, you, you. Yeah, if you wouldn't mind handing it. Yeah, that'd be amazing. Okay. This is the game session where I just ask Alan to hand me. <laughs> okay, I'm back. Carlos is saying. Um, oh, that's nice, Sarah. The map HP of the rammer is the damage to the victim. Oh wow. my God. Well, Page 42 is what we're looking at, and that's what I'm trying to say. It's the. Uh, oh, okay. I guess that makes sense. Well, the match, but, max HP of Gronda is 35. Yeah. Um, What's the max HP of this van? Same. Is so, that, do they take them? They don't take them. They don't both get destroyed by this. That's yeah. Insane. That's crazy. Look at the size difference. It's like a semi truck. I'm gonna rule the Hummer. just for the sake of, of moving on and, and resolving this. I'm gonna rule that, um, um, because it's a slow start, and that vehicle stopped. I think I think they're both just gonna take half, and that's we'll just do that. Fair enough. Uh, I also didn't mention this last time, but uh, Granda did take that damage too. From the uh, gallon gun, for the minigun. Oh, she did. Um, actually, let me see the arc. The ninety degree arc from the side. Is she? No. Uh, depending on how they aimed it, she might have. No, because it's going from mana over. So, no, she didn't take it. It's fine. Okay. All right. Okay. Uh, so yeah, the the van gets smoked. It gets um. And all of a sudden, there's a loud skid and a crash, and just glass and debris going everywhere from the windows and stuff. Um, the I'm gonna give from the smoke and the um, ram. Uh, I'm gonna give you all a plus three on your evasion on the next time. Okay. That's great. But so far, all I've done for my turn is speak into my phone. Great. I am now going to charge the guy with the gun. You are insane. Go ahead. <laughs> I had uh, considered that too. Yeah. <laughs> There we go. Well, I guess thing. mechanically, no I'll matter how far you are from the gun, you're still going to take the same amount of damage, even though in reality he'd probably swing it onto you. <laughs> yeah. If the gun's on top of the van, maybe he can just crouch under it and not get hit. Well, also, like, he's currently being rammed, so I imagine he's not firing at least for a second. Oh. Uh, are you keeping track of Ronda's HP, by the way? Yeah, the, uh, okay, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so I'm running at that guy, and I'm going to attack him. What have I got to hit him with? Um, Are you going right up into it? Yeah. In fact, I'm not even going to attack him. I'm going to try and wrestle the gun away from him. It's okay. mounted to the vehicle, right? It's Yeah, but it's on a swivel, so you can you so can Yeah, I want to grab it. the barrel and just turn it and yank it out of his hands. Or if not the barrel, the barrel probably spinning. This barrel is spinning. But I'll, I'll grab whatever I can grab and just try and yank it away from where he's pointing. Uh... At. Uh, okay, let's do do an attack and then an exert. Right, it's melee attack and then yeah, exert. but then I want to I want to I'm I'm thinking about exactly what Brick would try to do. I think what I would actually try to do is duck under the barrel, and lift it up to try and rip it off its mount. What do you think? I'm I'm thinking of how badass this scene is looking, and I'm trying to think of like. Why isn't there mechanical things I can do to you for being that close to the extremely loud and You can very shoot powerful... me again. Well, he's going to shoot you anyway, but like, anyway, go ahead. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I am running towards the gun, so if you wanted to say that I'm taking damage while doing it, I'd be fine with that. I think but... that's going to happen. I think okay. we should. The, the gun is mounted to the to the truck, though, right? Yeah, but it's, yeah. it's, on, a, it's on a to... swivel so we can aim. Yeah, I'm, tr I'm trying to rip it off its mount. That's expressly. Oh, you're trying, trying to rip it off. You're not trying to just move the aim. No, I I changed my mind. I wanna I wanna <laughs> get under it and try and rip it off. And if that doesn't work, at the very least, I'll aim it upwards. And Ooh. question: are, Were the people holding onto the gun when they got rammed? Were they like secured in some way, or yes. did they go flying? Yeah, okay. no, they're 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 fine. Uh, they're fine. Don't um. Worry. 
I think you are smart enough to see that. Um, you know what? You can try. It's going to be very difficult to rip it off because it's a solid steel mount. That's well. Thing. I would I would suggest that even a failure to rip it off its mount would still maybe be a success to at least. Let's do a gra up. we'll do a gradual. If you hit yeah. a certain threshold, you can move the aim. If you hit a, the, a high threshold, you can uh, all right just rip it off. Well, I've got Prodigy and Strength. My Exert is only one, which is good, not great. Okay. My Prodigy is in Strength. So that's eight on the dice, plus uh, another four is 12. Uh, um, give me a, an attack roll, too. Okay. To sort of connect. Base attack bonus. Yeah, like a melee. Oh, I don't think I... Oh, yeah, it is. 19. That's number one. 19 okay yeah so you, okay great you connect and 12 was your total mm -hmm. wow yeah 19 um, for my hit and 12 for my exert yeah you got five on the dice so um man this is like it's like around the edge i think <laughs> i'm gonna give it to you i think you okay <laughs> so you describe this to me as you're running up the 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 fire from this thing is actually singeing your fur or your, your hair and your the the percussion is knocking your hair back your fro back and everything and potentially my fur as well because the clothes were ripped last okay time. yeah so yeah. all of it is just getting singed mm -hmm. and, and uh um i am going to do one attack roll against you on it just because you're walking into fire god that was four 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 five on the dice okay uh you can evade that by the way you can try to evade that too like you're you're you can try to dodge it so i'm gonna choose not to evade it okay great i think brick is just seeing red great what would you say four 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 five yes so 17. yeah great okay so i should have been at uh 49 and minus 17 is 32. For those wondering how the hell a level 5 character has hit points like that, because I took the hard to kill edge, but Matt also allowed me to take the die hard focus from Worlds Without Number because of what my character is. So I ended up getting 20 extra hit points. I'm well. too nice. Yeah. Very and nice. And that's why I'm now ripping the minigun off of a band. Very nice to you. Yeah, so <laughs> just right, yeah, just right. You, you, you walk into this fire. Yeah, you you take bullets like I think I run. Yeah, but yeah. I, I mean, yeah, you're not. Walking. I shoulder yeah. into the thing. And yeah, just that that distance. I'm just like, well, I'm getting hurt anyway. Blah! You feel the burn of the bullets ripping through you, mm. and the, and the, the yeah the fire on you. So yeah, like, and so then I I duck down and then come slamming up into the minigun from below. I can feel the barrels spinning and the heat from it, and I also feel like. The two little pops as the bolts attaching it to its mount just sort of come out. As you're lifting to, the van creaks and tilts to the one side a little bit. And I take the gun and I, I rip it away from the guy holding the other end of it. And then I just, as the as the van sort of flops back down, probably bouncing on its struts, I'm now holding the thing on my shoulder and I just look at him and go, Can I borrow this? Uh, it definitely stops firing at that moment because <laughs> it's no longer connected to its power source. Uh, yeah, if he didn't have a mask, you would probably see absolute bewilderment and shock right now. <laughs> but he has a full face mask and glowing eyes as he looks at you. It's better to burn out than to fade away. <laughs> Damon, <laughs> how do you follow that up? How far am I from the door to the uh, kill count? Can I make it through the shots? Uh, I'll measure it. From where you're at, you're literally 10 feet or whatever, meters. Meter, yeah, you can do it. You know what? I'm uh, running in. Four meters. I'm running into the door of the kill count. And at the same time, I'm sending a message through my head comms to okay. Trans Alone and to D Res. Oh, I mean, I'm sorry, number one and number two. Wait, wait, wait. As you walk in the door, D Res, who normally sits by the door, uh, is on the ground bleeding with two bullet wounds to the back. Nice. Nice. <gasps> no! d -res. Also, actually, before you... Oh, actually, it's even worse. As you walk in, uh, and the fire, the gunfire stops, 
you you the whole kill count is a mess. There's smoke everywhere. The bullets were going through the walls. Mm -hmm. uh, bottles shattered, lights. The entire screen is destroyed. There's bullet holes all through it. There's people slowly getting up from the ground because they like hit the deck and some tables are flipped over. Uh, and there's a few bodies for sure. Nice. This place is wrecked. Damon is pissed off. <laughs> Anyway, what were you going to say? Sorry to interrupt. <laughs> you just, that's what you see so, when you walk in. I was sending through my text message, and through my head comms, a message to my number one and number two to say, send out anyone who's able to fight because I'm being attacked to the front with arms ready to the bear. I mean... Okay. Uh, well, you're inside now, so everyone who's ready to fight, who could fight, is getting up off the ground at the moment in front of you. All right. And um, as one of my instant actions uh, with my new focus, Dead Eye, I am readying one of my stowed range, my stowed heavy pistols. Pistols. I'm turning around and I'm crouching through the door, and I am going to take. Well, I can't see because it's probably still smoky, right? It's pretty. An, it's pretty smoky, and a lot of lights are destroyed. Some of them are hanging and swinging still, like creating like weird shadows and stuff, and. The smell of booze and blood and, and stuff is, is and debris is just overwhelming. Yikes! Yikes! Poor D Res. By the I way, uh, like... number one responds. Uh, will respond uh, in a minute. I'm saying. Do you want to take a look? Is is it obvious that if D Res was killed by the minigun fire going through the walls, or if he if there's somebody else in here shooting? It, it's obvious. Okay. Yeah, because D Res sits on a stool with his back to the door, uh, usually, um, mm -hmm. or side to the door, depending on his orientation. This time, he's got wounds from behind. So I think if you can get if this is resolved fast enough, I can get to him and heal him. Yeah. So you know, I think I'm going to. You don't even know about it yet. I don't know about it yet, but you do. I you do. see what I can do. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to be like, well, mm. sh I'm like shit. Good employees are hard to find. Um, <laughs> I'm going to crouch down, see if he's alive, and maybe do some basic pressure. Place some br basic pressure on to the wounds. So just so you know, I pre-rolled like some thresholds of, of uh, wound, killed and wounded inside mm -hmm. and some people uh, who are if they do get killed get killed um, they roll since the guy the minigun roll is 17 on its first attack uh, that's why the th that's why you're gonna see more deaths than, than you're, you're gonna be on the higher end so you can do um, if he's mortally wounded you can attempt to stabilize him with an uh, intelligence heal check or a dex heal skill check and it'll be a negative two penalty because you don't have you know carlos i totally forgot mm -hmm. to roll trauma dice on the minigun and i hate myself <laughs> actually just out of just for funsies oh sure are we gonna 12? find out if we've got any trauma no they only got it too so you guys probably all would have been okay anyway uh i have a seven Right, so I'm going, I see my employee lying there and I'm going to try to stabilize him. Okay. Uh, as you're you're doing that. But I want to keep an eye on, on the situation with the van. Yeah. Um, so while that's happening, um, at some of the people at the bar, one of which is Craker, uh, he's going to get up, stand in his, you know, massive glory, I guess. Um, what's going on out there? We're being, the bar's being attacked. Blue van in the front. It's gray van. Gray van in the front. It's only blue because it's my police <laughs> yes. car from We gotta get more vehicles. Yeah, we gotta get more vehicles. <laughs> gray van in the front. We're being attacked. Uh, so yeah, he hears it. Other people hear it. They're gonna get their arms going. Um, well, and we'll come back to that. Uh, so... Oh, and you said... Stabilize. Yes. So you said that's a skill check? Yes. And it's... <laughs> I guess that would be a heal check, right? Yeah. And I have a minus one. Oh, God. And then, uh, Sarah, you said there's more negatives? Is it a six? It's a negative, or the difficulty for the skill check is increased by two if you don't have a med kit. Which you don't. I don't have a med I kit. I have one, but I'm so not you're tired. minus three. Okay, minus three. We'll see. And it starts at eight? 
It's yeah, it's eight plus the number of full rounds since the target was down. Okay, so I you, you would have gotten it if you didn't have all the negatives. <laughs> I rolled a nine minus three is a six, so Damon just gets bloody hands. Do you have a trauma pack? So you're you're frantic, frantically trying to like put your employee back together. That's awful. Yeah, do you have any trauma patches or anything? Do you know what? I probably do, but I don't know if I. I feel like we all had one at cre character creation, but it's been a while. Yeah. It's been a long time since. That. Okay. While well, you look well, that up, we're gonna move on to the gunner and the band. Um, well, he's now looking at me holding his gun, and even though it's not powered, I have flipped it around to point at him. Um. Uh, so he's gonna say into his mic. Uh, Mission failed, let's get out of here. And he's gonna draw his pistol and instead of pistol, I'll, like quick draw it and try to fire at you. Yay. Uh, uh, eight, 18 to hit. Oh gosh, what's my AC at? Ranged AC is 16, you got me. Oh yeah. I, did, I actually didn't write down his heavy pistol. I know he has one, but I didn't oh. write it down because I didn't think heavy he'd ever get to Heavy pistol damage it. is 1d6. 1d6, okay. <laughs> That's so funny. What's the trauma dice? Oh, that's a wiener. Uh, trauma dice is one. Oh, I'm sorry. Heavy pistol damage. I read you the trauma dice. The actual damage dice is 1d8. Great. Trauma dice is 1d6. I should know all this, but I don't because it's been. Well, I, right. only, I only know it because I have one too. That's eight on the dice for damage. Okay. But only three for trauma, so he didn't get you. Well, I already used up all my armor soak, so here goes. So he, 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 you pull it off. There's a moment of, of silence, like as if someone just turned off a concert. And <laughs> then he quick draws and fires into you. Uh, and then he's like, let's get out of here. And the uh, the driver's gonna put the truck in reverse, or the van in reverse, and start backing up at full speed. It doesn't have to be my turn to speak, does it? Nope. I Lady, we're gonna follow them. Oh my God, really? Dude, okay, well, he just did a double six on his drive check, so uh, he's going to not only hit it in reverse, he's going to do a full skidding 180 and put it back in the right direction. Nice. Mm. He probably, let's see, in order to get the speed for that, he would have had to do like that kind of thing. Yeah. Okay. I mean, he would have done it a little bit down the road. Yeah. 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 Um, okay. That is their turn. You, you said, okay, well, we'll get back to you. Uh, this is being hilarious. Yeah. Half of lead blood. concert canceled due to them being full of suck. <laughs> hail of lead. Oh, hail of, hail of lead concert. Oh, yeah, oh. Even better. <laughs> I, you know what? Uh, we discussed this earlier, and I'm going to uh, rule that Archie is now unconscious. He's not at zero, but he's he's taken some traumatic damage and yeah. is knocked okay. out for the. Due to absence of max. Due to if absence he, of max. Yeah, uh, he does have the frail. Uh, no, he's not. He's not dead. He's not a, he okay. didn't hit zero hit points, yeah. so he's Alrighty. not dead. We're right. just gonna say it's some damage. He got hit in the head and yeah. or something, and, and got, yeah, or was all that later? No, he did. I didn't have a good way of getting rid of him, other than him going down. But he's frail. Uh, I feel like opening the session with a hail of gunfire is a good way to get rid of somebody. That's great. <laughs> <laughs> got rid of him, Max. You're done. Uh, Max came up with the best strategy of all of us to not die in this. So I actually, I'm not here. I was actually, he, ho I actually hoped he hit zero. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm not kidding. I was hoping he was. We were gonna have one more round of, of yeah. gunfire. I thought Damon would die, and then I thought some interesting stuff would happen. Yeah, yeah. Well, mm -hmm. interesting stuff is happening. All right. Um, you Ben. Mm -hmm. Ben is driving away. Uh, they are getting pretty far pretty fast. I have a question. Would we have heard, because I'm near Jube, would we have heard uh, Brick tell Granda to follow? No. No. Okay, so we don't know that our shelter is about to move. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there was a lot of tires squealing while I said There's, that. Yeah, I didn't yeah. think so. So, Chocolate Jube, or... silence. Mm. Your ears are still ringing. Uh, the you sign of the kill count falls behind you. The sign falls off? Yeah. Oh. Jube would follow, but he needs to check on Damien. To, he's okay. Yeah, stick into mm -hmm. your mm -hmm. your promise. Mm -hmm. I like it. Are you going uh, yeah. I'm double just gonna move? Go, I'm just going to into the kill count, yeah. 
Uh, when you get in there at this point, break, Breaker is issuing commands like he's in charge for some reason. You three over there, get medic, get pressure on these guys. Wins over here. You over there, and go the check whole, the back. A clear of mercenaries are pouring out the door to help us. Is that right? I just uh, got not, these not yet. Out. Not oh, yet. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Not their turn yet. He's, I'm just doing now? this for flavor. Now? Um, so he's just he's giving commands of people like there's so the kill count is a mercenary bar. Yeah. There's a lot of competition. Everybody wants to be at the top of the leaderboard. Mm -hmm. Some people even get to the point where they almost sabotage each other. But you attack the kill count, nothing unifies this oh, yeah. group like that. <laughs> so they are all working together and they are following Breaker's orders. All those people. All those people. Uh, it's Ty's turn. Okie dokie. Uh, well, I will... Let's see. Carlos. It's great out so many. <laughs> um, hmm. So, I see that the van is backing up. I will, uh, probably do a round of healing. I have healing level two. Healing now. word. So healing word. <laughs> um, I will get. I mean, realistically, I'll get to Archie, and we can uh, say my on turn is to stabilize him, such as it were, that I've that I'm satisfied. Is it? We yeah. can sort of hand wave it and just say, like, I'm satisfied that he's. Yeah, you dying. you're able to patch to stop any bleeding mm -hmm. uh, and prevent any further damage. Okay. Um, he's going to still be out for now. Can I make it to mana from where I am? Because that was my on turn. Can I make it with yeah. the rest of my move to mana? Uh, probably not. Probably not? Double double move if you had a double move. I would I... think you didn't need an action for uh, Damon. I mean, sorry, Archie. I don't. He's when on you... turn. Oh, yeah, great. There you go. <laughs> um, sorry. I was... But yeah, I'll, I'll do my full motion and dive behind Mana's table down next to her to see how she's doing. She's in full, like, crouch mode. Um, roll me a notice check. Sure. And I have no penalties to this. Okay. Uh, seven plus... Sorry, my notice is... Oh, my notice is negative one. A billion. And then, okay, so uh, that's going to be a total of seven, eight, nine. Nine on my notice. Okay, so as you approach, you realize, the, you, I mean, you're a medic. You would notice this. Yeah. Uh, you start checking her for wounds, and you're like, are you okay? And she's like, yeah, I think I'm okay. She's unwounded. A oh. single bullet hit her. That's, that's a hell of a thing. Yeah, I was going to say, on that, on that notice check... Can I, I look to my left and do, does the table have holes in it? The table doesn't have holes in it and neither does the wall behind it. Huh. Well, that's not... Okay, I absorb that. I, I'm i not terribly... Does the table have dents in it? No. The table wasn't hit. She wasn't hit at all. Okay. She doesn't well, have a bulletproof table. No. I will okay. say Ty's immediate thought is... Oh, that makes sense. They were here to shoot at us. She was to the far side. They started firing at us and swept. So that'll be Ty's immediate thought on that, but they will block that. Yeah, uh, totally okay. what happened. That is, yep, that's my turn. Great. Uh, that'll be Brick. Well, let's do it. I am uh now chasing that van but i'm letting the queen drive and i'm taking the gun oh my god <laughs> sorry you are a man with a grinch i'm pissed off they just shot at me and everyone i know that's true literally <laughs> everyone well not everyone, everyone i know in, in the yeah, city yeah yeah uh where'd my gun go drone cannon uh similar to I forget how my drone cannon works. Shoot it. You shoot. Yeah, you're right. That's how it works. <laughs> uh, what is... The one thing I, I always had a question about is how they actually measure speed. Because we might... Oh, here you go. Well, speed is... Uh, for vehicle combat, uh, it's, it's abstracted. Yeah. It's only in relation to each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just trying to figure out, like, if, if say, 
I'm glad you made it into a lightning strike on the van because I have no idea how far away the van is right now from you. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess five seconds of driving, it would still be within 16 meters. But anyway, continue. Uh, yeah. How do I do? I feel like Carla should just write the book of this story. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I'm just looking at my drone camera, and I don't remember. It's uh... it's not on your cool Excel sheet. No, oh, for that's some reason, right. It's not. It's a good thing you did not hit D-Res with the trauma patch. That would have killed him. Oh shit! I'm on the page that has it. But it's... Oh, vehicle mounted weapon. So you got drone cannon. Two D eight. Completely Here forgot yeah. about that. 2d8 and it can inflict traumatic hits. Okay, so vehicles. first I will attack with it. Oh, yeah, not... Sorry. Um, yeah, so attacking with the drone cannon, it's going to be... A terrible roll. <laughs> That's three on the die. Oof. There's no way you can... But, yeah. well, let's see. A two with my dex. Shoot is zero. Um, so that it becomes five, six, seven. Pretty good, uh, but no, it's not. Uh, so yeah, you you start picking up. You're far. You're you're behind. Yeah. Um, give me a, a drive check for Gronda to see if she catches up at all, or if you guys are gonna maintain distance. Now that I'm, well, I'm not driving. She's oh, I have to be driving, so oh, it will still tough. be unmodified. Yeah. Yeah. Eight again. Uh, you guys maintain distance. Okay. So that's probably why. So you guys are weaving in and out of traffic. This is a, a crowded street. Well, maybe a little less crowded because the gunfire was... Like, people are used to gunfire. Like, a few pots here, sh shots over there. This was... Have you ever heard an A-10 that's Warthog like... come in and do an attack run with a its Gatling gun? Oh, that's, yeah. <laughs> that's kind of what oh, everyone all the time. heard. Yeah, all the time, yeah. You still live next door to that. Yeah, it's, it's a very... Say. This was a war zone, mm -hmm. so even though it only lasted a few seconds, everyone ran to cover. So the roads are a little bit more clear. Um, great. I can't believe I missed. Damon, you're back up. Sucks. Oh, um, I'm gonna put the kill count on your initiative as well. So this is also when everyone's gonna start coming in to help. Okay, sounds good. I'll be like, medic, we need a medic in over here. Um, I'm a medic. All right. Well, it's one of the dudes from uh, the Blue Coats, which we don't have any mm -hmm. minis for. No, we do. We could pull up a cop. You got a cop ready? Uh, I don't have one ready. Yeah, I have one. Yeah, they're ex-cops. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I hate the case too. I, I regret buying that case. It's it's a great case except for the class. Yeah. No, I, I hate opening it. It's uh, painful sometimes. They're in here. I'll put one down in a second. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, that, he comes up and uh, pulls some patches out, or like he has a med kit on his vest, and so he like pulls out his stuff and he's going yeah. to attempt to but try the to trauma patch. You have to apply first to mortally wounded. If you yeah. hit somebody who's down with lurch when they're, then that kills them. Ooh. Um, it's minus. It's a nine now, but they they got a ten, so they do stabilize. Um, they're going now. I'm just going to pick up these walls. We can all still tell where the walls are because the yeah. sidewalk ends. The only reason we're still on initiative Jeff is because Steve decided to choose to chase the van. Yes, Steve. Are we supposed to just let them shoot at us and leave? Is that, uh, what, is that what everyone else's plan was? Uh, yes. So yeah, you, you shot no, medic. We can what else are you going to do? No. I am going to be like, who else is hurt? Let's start try a try a gene. Your number one comes in. Um, his arm is broken. Uh, mm -hmm. but he doesn't seem to be wounded any other way. Oh, and he's got a bloody nose. Which you immediately clock as a little strange for gunshots. Uh, he, he comes running up, it's like, there's, there's, there's people behind the counter, and, and he starts, uh, giving you a rundown of some of the injuries. Um, but he's still in shock and, and hasn't taken a full initiative thing yet. Uh, you have another guy, um, from... Um, I think it's also from the blue coats because they were at the table over there. Uh, he's gonna call out, Yeah, we got two down over here, and you can't see who they are yet, though. Okay, I'm going to go look outside and peek, and we're like, Ty, we need your help. Working on it. 
How's everyone out there? Alive! Um, some of the other kill count people I'm not even going to mention who uh, at this moment uh, come running out as well with guns drawn, like providing cover, and uh, I think they're going to like pull. They're going to go grab uh, Archie and start mm -hmm. trying to pull him by inside. Um, give me a notice check, actually, too. All of us? No, just 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 in. You ran back out and looked. I rolled a 10, plus my notice is an 11. Oh, yeah. So when you open the door, it sort of falls off its hinges a little bit. Uh, as you're looking around, like, saying that, uh, you notice the wall that took all the fire mm -hmm. is structurally not... Like, you're not a, an architect by any means, but you can tell by looking at it that this wall might come down. I'm like, well, shit. Uh, great. Van, uh, they're gonna just keep running. Uh, that's a drive check. That's a decent drive check, so they're gonna just, I think they just mean, like, they, they don't crash and they don't get away from you. Um, actually, yeah, they don't do it. Uh, the guy in the back, though, is going to reach out with his gun and fire at your car. I have gotten into the truck, because I'm gonna start, or I guess I'm on my way, he's not turning yet, but... 19 on the dice, so I'm, he definitely hits your truck. Uh, uh, you're, wait, you're, you're, are you actually on the gun, or are you inside the truck firing it? Remotely? Um, so I was initially on the, like, hood, yeah. using my phone to fire the gun. Okay. But I am in the process of climbing into the cab, because awesome. I'm going to take over the He's going to shoot you, then. He's actually shooting okay, you. Okay, go ahead. Because mm -hmm. you're the easiest. At this yeah. moment, I have yeah. more hit points than the truck. <laughs> uh, oh, only. Oh, that's not what I meant to roll. It's damage. That's the wrong dice. Uh, you only take three more damage. So he gives you another. Yeah, as you're like climbing, you hear, you feel the, the gray, the uh, the heat of the bullet enter like your arm. Okay. Uh, how much damage? Three. three. Sure. It doesn't hit any any bone or anything. So hmm. you just feel you feel that sharp bite. Oh, something bit me in the butt. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I feel like most of these aren't actually hitting me. Like, well, they're like, yeah, it's like points are abstract. Like, yeah. yeah. You've got armor, right? But not anymore. They do, they do hit you because <laughs> you have clothing. to take days to heal it. So, yeah. that's true. Yeah. Uh, awesome. And plus, you getting shot up to hell is more fun than not. That's true. I did, I did sacrifice a lot of other potential things in order to get 52 hit points. I may as well use them. That's their turn. Uh, Archie is still out. Jubei, you're back up. Okay. Very important question. Yep. Now that Jubei's in the kill count. Yep. How is Jubei's uh, show me board? <laughs> roll. Did you get a hit? Roll a luck straight save? luck. No, just not even a save. Just a straight. Just straight D20. D20. <laughs> I can't see it. What is it? What is it? It's what a is one. It? It's one. There is one token from your game on the, the bar. Everything else you can't even find. No, it's personal. It, and it's standing. It's just standing there by itself. It wasn't personal when they shot you and all your friends? No. <laughs> no. That's just business. That just happens every day. Did you? <laughs> that was from his master <laughs> game. So, no. actually, give me give me another check as well. Let's check. Joey, what's this like? This board? No. Notice. Yep. Putting on the Five, Jubei six, theme. seven, eight, nine. Great. You needed eight. Uh, because this is not going to be very hard to see. As you walk up to like mourn the loss of your shogi board, um, behind the bar is a wounded Akane, unconscious. What? She was at the, the the board and she hopped over the bar when the shooting started. All right, right away. I I. I, I by the way, I hundred percent rolled on the table of all the people in the bar to see who got wounded. Is she stable? Uh, no, right now she's not stable. No one's on her. No one's helping. What's her. uh, what's the trauma? 
the the trauma. The trauma is your emotional patch? experience. Right? Got <laughs> yeah. No, no, but you have a trauma do, patch? yeah. How do I use it? Uh, so let me see. It's like it automatically stabilizes them, I think. And then yeah. I'm sorry. Think which one? Uh, which one are you asking about? Is this just a um... trauma patch? A uh, trauma patch. It's in. Oh, I don't know that one either. It's on page sixty. Medic. Yeah. No, sorry. It, actually, the description's on sixty-one. Um. A trauma patch can be applied to a mortally wounded ally to stabilize them on a successful int or heal skill check, uh, int dex or he, uh, heal skill check against difficulty six with plus one penalty for each full round since the subject went down. Oh, you actually so, stabilized you guys then, because it's six, not eight that we needed. Well, no, that's if you use a trauma patch, because oh. it gives you a bonus. I don't, okay, you do it without, yeah. I don't think Damon had a trauma patch. I was looking so through my equipment. To... So roll int or dex plus heal. Yeah. Against six. Yep. Or, with a difficulty yep. plus one for each round since she went. How many rounds has it been since she went down? Three rounds, maybe? I think it's only been two because we've only it's come two. back around. Yeah. So it's the Is difficulty. That D20? It's eight now. Uh, two D6. No, it's two D6. Let's heal. You need to beat eight plus. Nice. He beat it. Six. Yeah. Eight on the dice. Yeah, oh, hell yeah. Plus Great. Whatever. So yeah, I use up my only trauma pack on her. Even though she's she's 100%. still mechanically like, unconscious, as you're healing her, she, uh, she just like grabs your shirt and like pulls on it a little bit, and then you know blacks back out. I, I whenever she blacks out, I say, "Don't worry, I will get whoever did this to you." And he's looking at his shogi board the whole time. <laughs> 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 She might have laughed if you, <laughs> if she was conscious. Don't worry, I'll find them. Oh, uh, well, thank you, Shogi Boar. <laughs> That's Ty. Me. That's you. Do it, Ty. I it am going to bolt into the uh, the kill count, but not before I yell over my shoulder back to Brick as I see him rolling past me with Granda oh, down the yeah, street. Yeah, the roar of the Granda engine. I'm going to try truck. to yell over it. I'm just going to yell, let them go. We can find them later. Everybody's and I... always like, find them later. I already found them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to break into the, or break four, not break into, break for the kill count, and I will start with D-Res. I'm gonna, as an on turn, I will uh, use my, uh, I will try, I will stabilize. So I, I will I, attempt uh, to stabilize somebody him. Somebody else already stabilized. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. did? Okay, I'm sorry. It, it, was, the, it was the blue, uh, one of the blue coats. Okay, is there anybody else mortally wounded nearby? Yes, uh, number two. Number two, okay. Uh, and mortally wounded? I thought she was on her. No, number one is fine. Oh. Number two. I'm confused. Isn't Drez? Drez is, is is not number two. Drez is uh. What do you call him? You have a nickname. Number two is Tramps alone. Drez is the dude. Oh, the, the dude. dude. That's right. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. All right. So I will. Yeah, I'll go for number two. So this is going to be a. And I'm going to do this without the trauma patch. Um, so this is going to be Reckless. eight plus, well, not really, because I have no, got no, a lot of bonuses. Good. So this is going to be, it's been two rounds or one round since he went We're, we're two? saying two rounds, yeah. Two rounds, so this is going to be a difficulty of ten. I get to roll 3d6. I get to add my heal and my intelligence, so that's four. So I'm going to roll 3d6. I got... Oh, oh no. Oh, That's no. pretty bad. I got five, and then I add my bonus of four to that. So that's nine. That's pretty good. That's fine. That's I good. did? Wait. I passed that? I thought it was, it's eight, eight plus two. Oh, you're two. right, you're right. Yeah, that's right. So I failed. Oh, oh, man. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, the wounds are pretty bad, and yeah. it's... Yeah. Nine's generally a... Very solid roll in this game. Yeah. yeah. I guess not in this case. No, you need 10 for this one. Yeah. Um, okay, so that's going to be... No trauma patches? Uh, I fail at that was my on turn. Yeah. So for my main action, I say shit, and I do the trauma patch. Okay. And so that's going to drop the difficulty down for me. Six and so that's going to be... Eight. Yeah, so it's going to be an 8, and I get to re-roll that. You're not dying on me. 
That's a better roll. So uh, yeah, this is going to pass because I have a someone who can give you help. Four, so yeah. that's eleven. Oh if yeah. If I rolled that yeah. the first time, I could have saved a trunk. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. So there you go. It took me my whole turn, but I've got number two is uh, unconscious but stable. Yeah. So yeah, you stop the bleeding. Mm -hmm. uh, a couple chest wounds. Um, there's immediately like there's another one down over here. Um, right. And I'm moving on to mm -hmm. the next one. Uh, and that one is going to be one of the uh, cat claws. Well, that I think that's my whole turn. Yeah, yeah, I'm letting you mode. know yep. who you see. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm in triage. Yeah, you're in full triage. And these are just the down people. These are not the wounded. There's like yeah. a lot of wounded as well. Once we get to wounded, I, I took healing level two. Uh, so we are, we're going to have a lot. I've got quite a lot I can do. But yes, yeah. I got to stabilize people first. Two of your employees on the same thing. Mm-hmm. They did go down. Damon, oh, they did go down. Damon's yeah. pissed. Yeah. Especially when he saw the sign fall down. Brick! Build me a house. I'm Please doing a maneuver. A brick. Okay. Ow. Vehicle maneuver. Uh, I am going to cut them off. I'm going to get ahead of them and block their escape. And this will be a posed drive check. Okay. Uh, this time, Brick is actually driving. Oh, okay, great. Because, yeah, he, this is a decent commentary. driver. Yeah. It's like the only purpose of this man is to drive. Uh, I can't mm -hmm. drive even that far. <laughs> Got my glasses. Seven on the dice, plus two is nine, plus two is 11. They also got 11, so yeah, you, you got it. Okay, so I've cut them off, so they are they must stop moving forward. Or, or ram you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, That's on their turn, though. We'll resolve that. Yeah. Um, that's it. Oh, yeah. Uh, wait a minute. That's my main action, is yeah. controlling the car. Yes. You could talk to him on the loudspeaker. Thank you. I, I as, a, as a humanoid, still have my own movement. Yes. Could I... This is all abstract now, because we don't have a... Room, yeah, get but out. Could I get out and run into their car? So they can't drive away from me because I will be in their car. Let. Yes. Uh, let's. Fuck it. Let's resolve it now. Um, actually, give me. So, I wanted to wait till their turn because they are going to ram you. Um, sure. I'll just be in their car while they do it. Yeah. So, let's resolve this now because I can't wait. Uh, they're going to ram you. Um, okay. Remind me how to do that again. Oh. Uh, it's just we're just. You're, opposed drive check. But you're not, you're, you're intentionally, so you choose to fail. Well, yeah, I mean, if I'm leaving the vehicle, this, this is the what we discovered previously, yeah. is that the rules are actually very vague. Yeah, very vague. Um, you know, it would normally be opposed drive checks, but since I've left the vehicle... Yeah, you they, you can't evade it. Yeah, They're, and if... can only drive in simple... Yeah, as written, the, both vehicles would take the full hit point damage from the ram, which doesn't make any sense because they'd be that, destroying yeah. their own vehicle. Yeah. Um, so, uh, I say you just decide. Well, you also you make, have... You make up something better and we'll do it. Okay, great. Uh, uh, let's just do... I'm still using drive, though. Um, I can see why they chose this, the, the path of the HP, because they don't have any other stats for, like, ramming. Uh, so, let me do a drive check on them. Um, it's not bad. What's your truck's AC? Eleven. Uh, yeah, eleven. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do the drive versus your AC. Uh, okay. And they fail by one, luckily. Uh, so they just hit some. So they're gonna hit your truck. Uh, yeah, but, but it's, it's a heavily armored but they, truck. Yeah, exactly. So, they just so just they're gonna take yeah. damage, but your truck's not. Uh, so that still only takes them down to. Uh, the the van is fucked, though. It is. So they slam in the side of your truck. You're getting out of the window right above them, like right where they hit, basically. Awesome. So I want... Um, Can we say just for flavor that I kick out their windshield and climb in that way? That Okay. First of all, give me an acrobatics or... or okay. Or exert. Exert, exert, exert yeah. decks. Yeah. I mean, if, if you're going to make me roll for it, I won't kick out the windshield. No. Just go around I'm rolling it. to see how badass this is. It's going to happen no matter what. Uh, <laughs> double sixes on the dice. Uh, plus one for exert is 13, and I guess, am I, what am I rolling for exactly? Kicking the windshield or climbing out? 
Uh, no, just keep. Okay, so here's what happens. Okay. So, <laughs> well, because it's it's. I'm gonna start from the beginning. Either 14 or 15, depending on whether I'm. Using Don't worry about it. Okay. it. It's amazing. <laughs> so your truck comes in. Uh, you you take a you know the area a bit better than these guys do, so you're able to take like a back road and get ahead of them a little bit, and you you come out right in front of them, and they just. The, they it's they either don't have enough time to react or they gun it on purpose, but they slam into the side of your truck as you're climbing out your your driver's side window, uh, and as they hit, the van tilts upward and you jump and smash your feet through the the driver's side window right into the driver. And I'm just gonna say he's a basic dude, so I'm just gonna say he's immediately killed. Okay. Uh, he's unarmored. He's just like a driver. Um. Uh, Unless you I would like I was going to do non-lethal damage. Then you could do non-lethal. I want to take these two guys both back. He's unconscious. Okay. Great. Uh so then you're now feet first into the driver's seat with an unconscious man. I've at least got this guy. Yeah. Um and do we want to play the rest of the combat out with just us or do we want to cut back? Because uh, I want to get the other guy too. You, if you want the other guy, yes. Only because uh, we're just gonna do this as its own combat. So yeah, this is just gonna be back and forth initiative real quick. Yeah. Uh, just to speed everything up. So you... Um, they rammed me, I jumped through the windshield, so it's his turn again. Yeah, so he gets up from the ground. Um, I think they take damage too, right? If it's a hit like that. The guy in the back? Yeah. Yeah, he, he'd be fine. Yeah, okay. He had his seatbelt on. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so... You did actually. I did say he did have a seatbelt on, so he's fine. Yeah. So he unlatches. Actually, he cuts the seatbelt off because after an accident, the seatbelt is stuck. Uh, and he comes at you with a large knife. Um, it's very tight quarter. Like you guys, like it's inside of a van, but it's a it's a delivery van. It's a bit taller, so you guys can still kind of almost stand up. And he's just going to straight attack you with that. Uh, and he's still a little discombobulated <laughs> from the accident. He got a net one, uh, or a, a critical fail. So he goes to stab and like kind of fall forward into the and stabs into the dash um, of the vehicle. Understood. Um, yeah, Your turn. it is indeed. Um, yeah, let me just punch him. What is unarmed strike damage? That's what I want to know. So oh, there is that. It's like one d. Four plus I strength. mean, I could club him with my guns, but I don't. Oh, it's 1d4, yeah. I think. All right. Well, I'm going to just punch him. Hey. Or no, it's actually 1d2. Sorry. Oh, d2. Flip a coin, caught. baby. Oh, gosh. Uh, it's a three. I missed. There's <laughs> okay, no way. yeah. So you guys, you guys are both kind of taking in the new fighting space. Yeah, and we're right trying to fight through two seats. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. yeah. But it's, it's awkward. Actually, no, it, it's less, it's it's a bit more of like, like weird blocks and like struggles. Wait a minute. How many hit points does this guy have? A lot. Does he have more than 41? No. Can I take his hit points and damage and just say I won? And we'll just speed along? No, because <laughs> his next turn he's going to try something different. Okay. Uh, so he ta after this turn we can do that if he fails. All right. Uh, if he fails to get away, because he's actually just seeing the situation, uh, he's gonna actually pull back, grab a frag grenade, pull a pin, and drop it and run out of the van. Mm -hmm. uh, so that's gonna go off. Did he drop the pin too? But yeah, he pulled the pin and dropped. It. Yeah, he dropped the pin too. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I wish, that it, I wish that it was the one turn, like, five seconds. Because it just takes, like, five seconds for a grenade to go off, right? Yeah. Or three, three and a half or whatever. Um, I don't want this other guy to die. I want to question him. Yeah. Well, he doesn't want you to. Yeah. These guys are good. No, this guy's good, anyway. The driver's just a driver. Um, what's the damage for a, a grenade? Uh, on the grenade page. Yeah, well, I oh. opened up my character sheet, and now I have to go back to the book. Grenades. Uh, grenades are 56, page 56. Which grenade flush frag or a frag, frag yeah. inflicts 2d6 damage on all victims in range plus a chance for traumatic hit. Okay. Evasion saved can half the damage if he can make okay. an evasion. Well, the uh, unconscious guy can't evade. He cannot evade. Uh, that's so a, that's, a, well, that's a execution. Let's do 2d6 damage, which is three. So he does. 
die. So he takes damage <laughs> while unconscious. If I pass my evasion save, can I choose to take the damage and shield his body? If you pass it, yes. Okay. I'll let you do that. Like you jump on the grenade. I know I'm I'm being real uh, shenanigans. No, I love tonight. it. That's uh, awesome. <laughs> if you jump on the grenade and take it, I will let you have it. I pass it. Fifteen against nine. Okay, so you're gonna take. I don't want to jump on the grenade. Break. I want to jump on the guy. Okay, okay. <laughs> well, you still take both. So you yeah. take six damage. Okay, Shenanigan. great. Uh, oh, and then um, what's the trauma dice roll on a grenade? Uh. Trauma dice roll on a frag grenade. Yeah, the trauma die is one d eight. Oh, I have a one d eight. That's right. Okay. It's a You're eight. not the only one. <laughs> eight for trauma? Yeah. That's my trauma target. So, and it's th is it three times or two times? Times two. Mm -hmm. So you're taking 12 damage. Okay. That's fine. So yeah. Oh, boom. La 12 damage. Actually, so here's what's... So it destroys the van too. So you, you come in, you grab this guy, put your back towards the grenade, it explodes. The van goes with it, and you and the guy go flying out the other side door, uh, <laughs> and you ride the door on the ground. On the this is like uh, mm -hmm. Lethal Weapon 4. Hey, what's your max HP? 22. What's that? 22. 22? I'm at 29 right now. I know. I... <laughs> <laughs> That's why I was like, man, what a nice DM. Wait, how... <laughs> <laughs> hey, you have the most powerful weapon in the game. Well, you have one third of the most powerful weapon in the game. Yeah, it's just I, really I, gave up, about the game I gave up my level 5 focus and edge to be able to do this. Exactly. Uh, he oh, wanted to take. I, I can see goal. how much of a burden it is. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Terrible. Uh, I have to have to think about stuff. <laughs> so he's gonna move his full movement away from that. Okay, well I'm chasing him. You're just gonna leave the guy on the street. What the unconscious guy? Yeah. Uh, yeah, this dude's full movement is what ten yard, ten meters. Same as your or thirty feet, I guess, 30, or whatever that. Ten, yeah, ten, ten, you're right, ten. ten meters. Ten. Um, sure. If you move faster than him, you could take the rest of his HP and damage them. We'll call it. That's what we'll do. Okay. Wait, wait. How much is his HP? What's the, what's the threshold for a major wound? I can't wound, do that. For a major wound? Not anymore. Um, I... Or you could just take this guy right? and be done. He'll just take this guy. I want to... I'll give it one more round. I want to try and catch this guy. Okay. I will He's run... He's full sprinting. Uh, I will... See, so double moving? He's going to double move. Not this turn, but next... Because he used an action for the grenade. The okay. Next turn. Then I will chase him down and use my action to uh I'm gonna snipe him. I'm not gonna chase him. Nice! I'm gonna pull the sniper <laughs> right oh, on. I didn't even think it's of that. If you take a traumatic hit and you're mortally injured. You're standing okay, so you're standing oh. in the street, people are gawking, you pull out your sniper rifle. The rolls tonight. And you miss. You miss real bad. Um it, it is a two. My D20s have come up three three two. Like all, all my attacks. So he's gonna double my saves right. have been great. What's your range on the sniper? Uh, I'm just trying. To, uh, the range is enormous. It's a uh, thousand, two thousand. I'm gonna give you two shots before he's around the corner. Okay. One more time. Here, I'll take this. I'm gonna borrow Max's. That's better. Mm -hmm. Twenty-one Thank to you, hit. Max. <laughs> that hits him. Okay. I'm gonna roll the d10. Uh, so that's six. Oh, that's the, that's the trauma die. Sorry, I keep reading the trauma die when I mean to read the damage. You didn't get a trauma hit. Though. Okay. Damage is twelve. Okay, that's a good hit. Uh, cool. All right. Uh, yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead again. One more. So yeah, you fire. It's loud. It. This is your second shot already, and then uh, your second shot hits him. <laughs> Kind of the shoulder, and he stumbles a bit, but he keeps going. Third He's shot. aiming for the corner. Oh, so yeah. So he gets around the corner, and the goat is gone. Yeah. All right. Back to you guys for now. I still got one guy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got one guy, and I harmed the other guy. So yeah. Uh, just while what they're doing, whatever, mm -hmm. I'm bringing this guy. Back. Yeah, I figured you. Yeah. I'm gonna have you roll back up in a minute. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. We're out of initiative now. Anyone can do anything they need. So Damon here is making a bunch of phone calls and. He's also say, telling people to stay away from this wall, to move back from the mm. wall. Nice, nice. He's making phone calls to structural engineers to maybe check out the wall, cleaning crew to <laughs> start cleaning. Um, he's also going to be putting a bounty on Mox. Nice. 
right. and I want to call for an information broker to see if I could um, get any information on Mox. Okay. Um, like, Breaker, who hears all this, is like, perhaps it might be wiser if you went underground for a little bit. Hey. Point. I do need to talk to the rest of my crew, though, first. Thanks, Breaker. Yeah. And then he goes back to helping people. Uh, anyway, continue. So you're calling information brokers about Mox. Um, uh, give me it. I guess connect would be the best. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. exactly what mm -hmm. connect is for. Right, let's do it. Yeah. That's a three. Sorry, man. We got nothing. Like this guy's a ghost. He's out there, man, but he's he's hard to get. You know, this person works for Shockwave Combine. He is their point of contact for jobs. And you're telling me there's nothing? He's not listed in their books. Does he even work for Shockwave Combine? That's what he says. All right. I'm going to keep posting. Let me know if you find anything. Okay. Uh, so you put a bounty. Did you still want to put a bounty? I... Are you part thinking of money? You... <laughs> well, I have sixteen thousand dollars. Caches. I have sixteen. <laughs> I have sixteen thousand <laughs> caches. My favorite. Caches is what we call money now because of a yes error indeed. that we kept. <laughs> I will put up a ten k bounty. Wow. Okay. Uh, mm. the 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 entire job board is destroyed right now. Mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. it's like on paper at the moment. And I'm, and it's I'm. Post -it it's a post-it note. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> post -it note? Yeah. Uh, do I have a post-it note? Of course I have a post-it okay, note. Okay, so you. <laughs> and I'm also. You both have post-it notes. In, in fine print, I'm putting, do not accept shockwave combine jobs. Okay. So in, as the smoke is starting to clear, some of the lights are still flickering and everything. And like people are lined up, wounded people everywhere. You walk up to the broken kill count board and put up a, a post-it note that says Mox 10,000. And then I scribble a little picture of what I think he looks like. Uh, uh, the, the, um... Actually, I don't have that information. The cat so. claws come up and they write plus 5,000. One of their members were taken down. No. Um, All right. All right. Is that you? That's right. me for now. Okay. I am going to continue to triage. I assume that a lot of folks have their own trauma patches and are yeah. working on their own people. Yeah, blue coats are covered. So breaker's fine. How many more people are down? No one else is down. I think you guys saved everybody, or at least stabilized everybody that was okay. down. Uh, there's about 21 people who are wounded. Yep. In just various states of wounding. Um, okay. Yeah. So here is the benefit that I get by using my focus upgrade uh, or my focus on healer level two is that with only basic medical supplies, I can heal 1d6 plus heal skill hit points of damage to every injured or wounded person in my group with wow. 10 minutes of first aid adds no system strain. Okay. So to what, how do we want to, since I've got unlimited time, do we want to say maybe 30 minutes? For 21 people? I would say it's more like an hour. Okay. About like 10 minutes per six or so. All right. Five. How would you like me? Do you want to group them into like groups? Plus your, plus your group. And, yeah. I'm assuming we probably don't want me to you roll. You don't have to roll all that. You roll for these guys. Oh, okay. NPCs will just say got enough healing to be happy. Okay. So everybody took damage, right? In oh, our yeah. group? Oh, uh, at this point, you're going to roll up too. When I do... Mm -hmm. Is the minigun still lying in the street? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm taking that and later I'm going to attach it to Granda. Okay, there's going to need to be, because you didn't take the computer side of it with it, so you there's going to we'll be some work. Well, yeah. there's gonna be, it, won't be, yeah. it won't be this session, but we'll figure it out. Yeah. Uh, go ahead. Okay. So I just go ahead. You're going to get... I start with you, because you're right in front Wait, of me. Wait, I think I evaded the bullet fire. Oh, do you have no damage? I have no damage. But didn't you take half damage on the minigun? Half damage, damage. Oh, that's armor right, yeah. soak, you probably took three. You took three, that's right. Mm. Damn it, so I'm at 14. All right, so not bad. You guys just I... had a rough ass day. It's not over yeah. yet, there's still, still 
A lot of day left. <laughs> a lot of evening There's left. so much day left. Yeah. Uh, Fine, scared. All, All right, right. take heal plus. Do I get um? Do I get to add my heal. attribute? Yeah. To my heal as well. Yeah. Okay. It's int. It's, uh, or this dips. says that basic, I can hit it's, 1d6 plus heal skill hit point. Yeah, I think that's just it. I think so I, I can add my heal plus my attribute of intelligence? No, I think it's just... Oh, okay, I'm so sorry. I heal. thought you were asking okay. about the check itself. All right, so you're going to take six healing, so you're oh. fully backed up. Yay. Sorry. So kind of uh, you, Ty. Jube, I sneak up behind you while you Ooh. are staring at this port. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to heal you whether you want it or not. Uh... Please take three consent. healing damage. I mean, you're going to feel it. Damage. It's not like you just yeah. touch them. <laughs> yeah. Like, you, I, you, if you want to make it a fight, but I'm no, just going to no, walk no. up. Yeah. I'll take it. No. He's okay. very sad and depressed. Yeah, and so mad. she starts right. patching up the wound on your shoulder. And yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'll take care of uh, Brick while you... Or I can take... I mean, realistically, I'm going to start working on all the people inside the building before Brick gets in. Um... Do you want me to go ahead and... How do you want me to roll for, like, the room? Uh, just, just roll for Brick. It. Okay, I'll uh, roll for Brick. Now, and then we'll, when he gets back, we'll deal with that. Sorry, that's two points. Of you honestly didn't damage. know where to start on him. Yeah, I'm like, also, here's I'm a probably band aid and a lollipop. I got nothing. If you're out in the main part of the club, you can't work. Yeah. Because I'm, okay. I'm trying to cover yeah, up exactly. my block. Literally, like you, you've got a little like scratch on your forehead. Literally, I put a bandaid on it. That's okay. the points. Yeah. Of, there you I got go. one. That's all I got right <laughs> yeah. now. Later, I'll let you work on me. In uh, private. Don't even worry about rolling oh, yeah. for the rest of the thing. An hour later, we'll. Yeah, it's just a very, very long hour of being extremely yeah. focused. You have an insane amount of other people drilling blood on you. in, directing people, getting people help, sending people to get supplies. Actually, I'm yeah. sorry. It's going to be a lot less than an hour because you have other medics helping. That's true. Yeah. So it'll it'll be like twenty minutes. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. And do I need to roll to? No. Okay. I don't need to roll to do nothing else. Yeah. No. Yeah. All right. Just it's. And just then, not, you're not under pressure, so it's fine. Yeah. And at the end of it, I just collapse onto a stool at the bar, look up and see Damon's note, and the cat claws addendum. And I look to you and I say. Because this is the first time I'm getting caught up on this. Shockwave did this? I don't know. We can ask this guy. <laughs> oh, well done, Brick. So Thanks. You, you're carrying oh. a, 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 like, kind of a, a normal, like, dude with, like, just a vest and some leather pants and uh, a, like, ski mask over his head. And that's, like, that's all he has on him. Oh. He also myself. had this one picture. It looks like a guy, but there's too much blood. Mostly mine. He had a picture? He had a picture in his pocket of some guy. I don't know. It's just some guy. You've never seen him before. I want to see the picture. I take that. Have I seen him before? <laughs> no. No, I, I made up the picture. It's oh, not a map. No, no, it, I just, just assume. He, I will go with it. Fucking just go <laughs> yeah, with it. I'm just saying he had a picture of his boyfriend or something. Yeah. <laughs> no, always pull that stuff. I love it. Yeah. It's, it you know, we're, we're in popping here. Let's go for it. Uh, I just didn't want Sarah to waste time trying to figure out who was in the picture. <laughs> no, you guys, I think this is where the story is going, and we should focus that the whole where rest you of the session. That meme follow the useless yeah. prop to <laughs> the world. Uh, you guys, I think this duck is important. Uh, let's see if we can shake him awake. Well, I'm sure, Brick, you did that. Uh, before we resolve this, uh, Jube, what are you doing throughout the healing process? Again, just att attending to Akane. Looking for yeah. your game pieces. Yeah. <laughs> I do take the, the piece of the shogi that's still intact, and I put it in my pocket. Love mm -hmm. it. And I say, well, actually, wait, it was Shockwave, right? Yeah. That single shogi piece, he cards the back shockwave. Mm. He puts it in his pocket. God, it's yeah. so small. You must spend like an hour on that. It's like SW. Well, it's, it's, he probably SW. cards their logo. Yeah, yeah. There you go. I like yeah, that. Okay. Can you imagine this is the same as when in the opening you yeah. carved your yeah. name? Uh, yeah, I was just going to say, you probably you set it on the, the bar, name. pulled the sword. <laughs> <laughs> no, you did it there. If, that's how, you, if that's how you did it, I accept it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> also, um, Yes. 
to I, you? I, I did get the 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 hench the henchman uh, uh, ability. Oh, Ooh, very nice. Yeah, hedge keeper. <laughs> nice. And I want to hire one of the people from the cat claw. Mm. <laughs> um, I'm gonna. I'm going to say groups like that are not going to break themselves up. They will once they see that we were involved in this together. And, and they, and they, are and, you sure they'll be happy that? Well, they, 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 one of the guys got hit too. So they, so, so they noticed yeah. that. So because somebody it's like, brought it's like, it's like a working together thing. This to the show count. Yeah. Yo, know, I think what Matt is saying is that group isn't going to break up. You can't hire one of them. And, yeah, and yeah. well, I'm also saying that if people find out that these that this was here, that this was an attack on you guys, some people might not like that. Mm. Yeah, that you're. Do we even know that yeah, though? We don't. No. Pretty I mean, high I mean, level. Have but Jamin, because I have suspicions because of the phone call I was just on. You don't, yeah, yeah, you don't even fully know if it was Mox. But I just do that, so I'm like, okay. Rick, let's take this up to our office. Uh, Tylen, do you think you could get him lurched awake for us? Yeah. Uh, let's tie him up first. Yeah, we'll we'll take care of that. Okay. I need to sit down. Oh. I was in a car crash. Well, I was technically in two car crashes and I an explosion. I over the bar there was pour you a, a drink. Large gun. Thanks. Uh, roll me the luck with the people. There's even a bottle left, yeah. Oh. Okay. There's Most of the bottles are destroyed. Uh, you Actually, you know what? Oh. You know what? You got it. You got it. If not, I'm sure it's Tylen. There's one bottle and you got it. It's her, yeah. it's her uh, rot gut that she uh, like brews. What... Oh, yeah. I go in back to my... How does my clinic look? I go and look at my clinic. Uh, Was it hit? Do you want to... Do you do that now or after they're hit? You can do it now. I, I do it now. I go get you a drink. I, it suddenly occurs to me, like, oh my god, my, oh my god. Yeah, yeah, I absolutely want to know what's going uh, on back there. Yeah. Uh, you rush in and you really push the door open. Um, the bullet, a lot of the bullets right. came through. Uh, so there's a lot of damage. A, um, a lot of your your equipment yeah. is damaged. Your table's got holes in it. It's not as bad because it's gone through two walls at this point. Mm. Uh, But is my surgery is my surgery still in operating we order? The Your surgery? Yeah, I have level one surgery. Oh, um, set up back here. She was a one. Uh, give me give me a luck roll. Okay. It's just straight luck. You just straight, straight luck. Yeah. Ah, I rolled a twelve and my luck is eleven. Oh no is no, that... you're you're not doing a save. It's just a straight luck roll. Uh, oh, yes, your 12. your your surgery is um, it's functional enough. Like it wouldn't be the most optimal, mm -hmm. um, and I'm sure it definitely annoys you how messed up everything is now. Yeah, but everything I I can fix this. I can fix this. Yes, which it'll, you can't. It'll soothe me down. Mm -hmm. Fix. Yeah. Is the missing missing box. box? Yep. It would have been in my safe. Yes. So I, yeah, that's the first thing I check is my surgical equipment. Second thing I check is my lock. Safe's open. Mm -hmm. Box is gone. Shit. Just that? Are my files in, still in there? Are everything my, else is still in there. Everything else? Yeah. That's very interesting. This is very coordinated. So number number one comes in, uh, seeing you go in and like, I, there was a guy here for you. Um, I tried to stop him from coming oh. in here, and he broke okay. my arm, and hit me. Um, he yeah, might have I'm saved my sorry. life, because I, I was in the back getting cleaned up when the bullets came. Okay, I'm sorry, you, you didn't have to do that. I, I, it's, you're one it's, of us. I cry, tries not to burst into tears with that. Okay, uh, I, well, it's okay. <laughs> It's he's are you, sees you. Can, I, I, I pour pick a drink. Uh, what the hell? <laughs> I'm on duty, but I think we're all off duty right now. And uh, yeah, and he's gonna choose you and take a, a drink. Yeah. yeah, he's, he's gonna start tearing up too because he almost lost two of his friends. <laughs> yeah, um, okay, okay, cool. Um, wow, so every, all right, you guys just kind of lost a lot. Yeah. Um, 
Um, Not we great. should probably do break before we question the dude. Let's yes. do that. Thank you for oh, that. And so I'll also ten. ask them to yeah. bring Archie in and have him on my. Uh, oh, yes. I'll so clean Archie... off my table and he can sleep it off in here. Great. He's in my clinic. Room. And yeah. yeah, you patched him up though, so you're good. All right. We're going to do a break, 10 minute break, uh, bathroom and all that good stuff. Uh, we'll be right back and it's going to be great. Yes. See everyone then. Thanks for watching and chatting. Thank Cheers. you. And welcome back. Uh, so yeah. yeah, we just saw the kill count get mowed in half, Killed, almost. If you will. Yeah, <laughs> the kill count. Has We're counting kills. Gone mm -hmm. up in kills. Uh, you guys are in possession of the driver of the van that attacked you. Uh, the gunner himself got away. You just discovered. Uh, Ty just discovered uh, that the box is missing. Yeah. Gibbs. Hey! What's up, Gibbs? Jube says to Damien, If you want, I can take care of the negotiations. Negotiations with who? With the, the prisoner. Oh, I think we'll all want to chat, but if you want us to continue in standing men and be menacing, my friend, Ooh. then do so. I know Ooh. quite a few uh, techniques make them talk ah oh, well and let's play a little bit of bad cop and more bad cop shall we let's do it um mm -hmm. uh, who's going with this just you two or, or i well, think brick's still going right yeah and we're just mm -hmm. waiting for tylin to Hi. so this guy is fully unconscious at, at the, the moment, moment, yes. Yeah. At the moment, yeah. Tied up in a chair, of course. Non-lethal unconscious. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah, I was gonna ask, mortally wounded unconscious? No, or just, just non-lethal. Okie dokie. Uh, you can... It's It's been, like, at least 30 minutes since yeah. you knocked him out, so you guys can just wait a minute and he'll wake up. No, 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 no. We'll wake him up with a... With a little love tap? Like yeah, some, yeah, no, 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 say, no, 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 maybe a, a, a bucket of water? Oh. Ah. 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 You guys, you guys yeah, took off mask off, right? Yeah, I assume. Yeah, bucket yeah, yeah, bucket of water. Uh, what does it look like under there? And we have a big spotlight on him. <laughs> uh, <laughs> a desk lamp, but yeah. the way we're holding. Yeah. He's a younger guy, uh, not very experienced looking. Doesn't have any wounds or scars except for the ones that he just got. Um, his his he does now. He's he's very. He's like, oh, he's pretty, he's pretty much albino. Like I, I don't want. He's not quite albino. Yeah, so he's white hair. Um, white eyebrows, everything. Um, very short hair. Kind of very normal looking albino character. You take the lead, David. I just look at him very coolly and go. What are you guys going to do? Cut. I just sort of pat your <sighs> cheek and go, talk. What about what? Like, what do you want to know? I think you know. Uh, my name is Rick. Oh, that's what a, a coincidence! <laughs> that's a, is your name Rick too? Kind of. I pat it's you Rick. back this way. That's a good start, Rick. Uh, are you gonna hurt me? That depends on you. Yes, I am. Okay. Gotta just keep that guy away from me. He's a little scary. Oh, you don't need to worry about Brick as long as you answer truthfully. Brick. Or my other friend. So, so at this moment, Jubei like kind of unhitches his sword a little bit, and you see some lightning sparkling right here. Uh, keep that guy away from me, too. Mm -hmm. right. Now, you came here for a very specific reason, didn't you? Yes. Who sent you? Uh, the man who paid us. I, I, I'm, I'm literally like just a driver for hire. I usually just transport packages. I look at you, Jubei. Mm -hmm. Mm. And J Jubei takes out his sword and he taps the floor, and just the shock from tapping the floor travels up the water and hits him. Oh, oh god! <laughs> I'm sure you could tell us a little bit more, don't you think? Uh, yeah. They, uh, I mean, there was like a big guy. Jubei, can you peel this orange for me? <laughs> Thanks, buddy. I like oranges. <laughs> a big guy. I'm out of oranges. <laughs> there's actually there's two big guys. And they look kind of alike, but they like weren't alike. What were their names? I did. I didn't ask. They didn't. 
introduce themselves exactly. They just handed me a wad of cash, gave me a, a van with this, not all that stuff in it, and told me where to go. Does he have cybernetics? No, very, very human. Very simple. Ty has been sitting on Damon's desk just watching this, and I will chime in. Were they wearing matching outfits? Yeah, yeah. Good and orange? Yeah. What does that mean? That's what the uh, Moxes to uh, Wonkies. Yeah. Uh, it's the Shockwave Combine security mm -hmm. uniform. Hmm. Was that your van? No. They were going to let me keep it afterwards, though. That was kind of my like, part so of my... So it was your van? It was going to be my van. I was going to use it for all kinds of deliveries. Well, your buddy there threw a grenade in it. Yeah, I wasn't... Wait, what? So he threw a grenade. See, I knocked you out. I was going to bring you back here to, you know, do this. And uh, I was going to bring him, too. But then he threw a grenade inside the van. Um, so I don't think it works anymore. On the plus side, I saved the minigun. I can't make deliveries with a minigun. No, I wasn't going to give it back to you. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Mm. I, that sucks. Yeah, well, that's not really your biggest concern right now. Well, I, I told you everything I know. I don't know anything else. Oh, I'm sure you could squeeze something else in that brain of yours. It was, it was a 500 cash job and... I was just supposed to literally drive and then drive away. It was supposed to be easy, in and out. You took a job... Without knowing exactly the details of that job? Listen, I normally deliver noodles. You took a job spraying minigun fire at a nightclub full of mercenaries the and kill you count. only asked 500 I, caches? No, I, I wasn't in... I, they didn't... Listen, I was Did you not see the huge fucking gun when you got in the van? Exactly when I got in the van is when I saw it. And it didn't exactly look like the type of guy I could say no to. Did you see that guy? Yeah, I saw him running down the street. And you didn't hear them mention any other names? No names. Even the guy behind me, I didn't know his name. But he was definitely one of them. He Why do you say that? Orange. <clears throat> he wasn't wearing orange. They came with him. Or they came with, they came together. Or maybe they hired him somewhere else and brought him. I don't know, but they were together when they arrived. Where did you meet the person to get the money? There's a small club. Uh, it's like, it's not actually a club. That's not the right word. It's more like a day bar where people just go to get hammered. And it's about the size of a uh, large bedroom. And how did you hear about this offer? Uh, they hit me up. I delivered some noodles to a guy, and he's he was really impressed with my my speed. I'm fast. I'm a fast delivery man. If you guys need deliveries, it's... do you still have the content, the the number to this guy? Do you have my phone somewhere? No. I mean, yeah, he's tied up, right? So he he can't really dig through his pockets. Uh, if it's not in his pockets, we don't have it. I didn't grab anything. We check his pockets. Yeah. <laughs> He does not have it. <laughs> the three. <laughs> it's still it's still the van looks like. Would you say they were regulars at this day bar you frequented? Uh, that's that's where they. I don't know. That was the only time going there. Honestly. Um, oh, I do know where I delivered the noodles though. Where? Where? Now you're taking initiative to help us out, and that's likely to I, get you out of here alive. I like not dying. Mm. So I'm, I'm, I understand anything, that point yeah. of view. What's what's the location? I uh, I can I can show you downtown. I it's. Um, I pull out my little a tablet. Where exactly? Okay, let me. Well, I'm, I'm tied here. Break. Right. I used her nose. Yeah, so I used her nose to like move around the map, and he's like, "Uh, I need here." And he starts using his lips to like zoom in. <laughs> uh, this is really embarrassing. Uh, and he he zooms in on. Um, if you hover the pin over, it'll give us an arrow. Oh hell yeah. This is cool. I've never okay. It's, hey. right, it's like right there on the edge. And where are we? The Planheim thing. Uh, you guys are up more than in the north. Okay. Would any of us be familiar with that area? Uh, that's gonna be a roll. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Have, have any of you been there? For reason? <laughs> I would also. Yeah. Yeah. I want to roll. You're, to that's see. Not for you. 
Yeah, that's inside the wall, though, so... Yeah. I want to roll a I mean, you're inside the wall now. I'm inside the wall now, but I don't... Is it... Uh, uh, is it what, what's the roll for? Oh, um... Shoot. Yeah. I rolled an eight. Survival or... Uh, a no check, maybe. Yeah, I was gonna. Add, no, I know it's good too. Given yeah. my yeah, given my yeah. background, if I could, yeah, and add intelligence. Yes. Or wisdom. <laughs> Please say it's double sixes. It's double sixes, and so uh, so that's gonna be eighteen. Uh, no, I'm sorry, uh, seventeen. Nice. Uh, Nine. You're like, uh, he's like, yeah, it's 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 new, uh, nuts noodles. And you you know that place. You've been there. Yeah, I wonder if this is yeah something. Yeah, you that you're I like know you know the area very well. Exactly. Yeah. Where that is. Okay. Uh, what did you get? I got I got nine. Okay, yeah. and you? An eight. Uh, you guys, yeah, you have, you don't have a lot of reason to go to that area. That part of town is a lot more mm -hmm. um, a little more poor than where you're at now. Really? Uh, okay. So there's not a lot of corporation presence or anything it's also right next to the wall um to the to the whispers do they call it mm -hmm. yeah um the whispers Cement. yeah you um, had by planheim basin as well yeah yeah uh yeah and the and the the basin is very polluted so it's not like a nice place to be mm. <laughs> this uh noodle place <laughs> so i know the noodle place yeah is it what do I? Would it have any corporate connection? Like, is it like the place? Like, is it like the place well, where all the corpos like to go to slum it? Like, oh man, you got to check out like the you know. You can be another, authentic. Let me not know. Uh, really? On an eight, actually, no, you're, no. Actually, like, you're good. You're good. <laughs> uh, what you do know is, cool. yeah, it's very unusual for corporate people to be in that area. Hmm. Okay, that's fair. Yeah, I, I just want to I just want to call something out. You have said before that just Edge City is the size of LA County. Yeah. So Ty lives up here. Yeah. And knows the exact noodle place over here. Yeah. All yeah. right. She's she, been a, she, she rolled a perfect roll. Yeah, like, she, you can't you, been around. Yeah. yeah, all right. She's been around. I'm just calling I mean, it they, they, sorry. She, hey, heal, she, she heals people. Yeah, maybe. True. Uh yeah. yeah, you you took a jog down there at some point or something. Yeah. And, yeah. yeah. So we we need so can, a, I, can I go? We no. We need a description of the guy. What guy? The guy that I gave you the job. Delivered. Yeah. 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 There's physical description. Oh, uh, it was a well it was a woman that answered the door and she was mm -hmm. um a working woman. So I don't I know the address but I don't know who was the hair name. color, skin color. What's the room tattoos. number? Tattoos. Uh red red hair tattoos. Blue eyes, very gorgeous complexion. The lips were very full and wonderful. And she had what kind of tattoo? Uh, the, so the tattoo, I couldn't see it all. Which I, one were you staring at? Uh, I was staring at the one just, just like right above the the uh, waistline. And what it's was like it? a dragon that goes like under the waistline and comes back out above it. Oh yeah. And you're okay. saying this lady was the one that uh that that recommended you for this job she's the one that received the order and then i got a call that they liked my service hmm. who sent you out just the the person of that apartment no you were delivering oh, I was, noodles oh i was delivering noodles for nut noodles nut nuts noodles. noodles okay so you you picked up from the lady yeah i picked up from nuts noodles okay. and delivered to the lady at the apartment I'm confused. I thought the location that I, just to clarify, the location that I knew and that I recognized, I thought he was giving us the delivery location, but you said That's, that was where the noodle place is. Yes. The noodle place is where they met. Did we just get raided? Holy hey! cow. Hey! 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 Welcome, everybody. I, all right. That happened so fast, I didn't even see who raided us. Yeah. Sorry, we're all engaged. We don't want yes. to the chat very quickly. A thrilling you. conversation about noodles. Ava and oh, advances. <laughs> ah. Ah. Uh, cool. Anyway, welcome everyone. You just missed the uh, mattress raid. Hey, I know We'll try are. to make They're it more great. interesting. Right. Yeah, you just missed uh, <laughs> the feeling, yeah, Kill interrogation. Count hotel, or uh, yes. sorry, club get absolutely mowed down. Right. Uh, these guys barely survived, and now they're interrogating one of the people that attacked them. That's right. Hey, welcome, everyone. Welcome. Very much appreciate you being here. So yes. just to clarify, he's told us that he was hired to pick up a delivery from the noodle place yes. and then deliver it close by to a lady at the apartment. Yes. And then they met me at the noodle place afterwards okay. to set this up. Got it. And so, and I'm familiar with both the both the addresses he gives. 
Uh, the you're familiar with the noodle thing. place address. Okay. You're not, the apartment's just an apartment, so you're, you've never been hmm. there. You know the, you probably have seen the building, but... Got it. Yeah. Okay. All right. So the lady connected hmm. you with some shockwave combine goons. Or the people They're at the wave. noodle place. I, I seriously didn't even know that. They were literally wearing the shockwave combine uniform. I don't know this. There's not that many major corporations. It, oh, my. Well, how I live? Yeah, uh, I just want to point wait. out... Not everyone's part of your whole gang culture thing. Some of us have lives. So, well, most people would know not to shoot up the kill count. I don't have a life, really. I'm just not was, anymore. What, was this? No, was, was, this was this the guy that was? Was this guy hold, using the mounted gun? No, this is the driver. Of the okay. Right. Yeah, he has said that he was terrified by the guy with the gun. Okay. Yeah. Oh, so, can I go? I almost lost two very. I think we employees. should keep this guy on ice for a while before we decide whether to let mean? him go. What do you mean? I meant the freezer. I meant ice. I start yeah. looking through my uh, my briefcase. No. I just kind of like touch you, and I. Why do you like touching me? So and much? then you um. Oh. Just go to sleep. Okay. He's oh, really, that's right. Yeah. Oh, you have like a sleep thing. I use um. A dose of pillow on you. Oh, nice. Oh, my gosh. There you go. All right, so uh, you don't even have to roll or anything. I don't, I don't, yeah. That that thing, so, uh, yeah, so he just... I think we got enough from this bozo. All right. Let's make sure what he told us was true before we get rid of him. Yeah, I did put up a bounty up on Mox, though, from Shockwave Combine. I was on the phone with him right before we got attacked, mm. and he seemed very interested in knowing when we would get back to the bar. Yeah. Guys, uh, you need to be aware, they raided my clinic. They took the thing that we recovered from the downed aircraft. I was keeping it in my safe. How would they even know we had it? It's a darn good question, isn't it? The only people that knew were us and Archie, of course. I didn't even have a chance to reach out to any of my contacts to even ask vague questions. I didn't talk about it. Brick, Jube. Who would I talk to? You guys are the only people I know in this whole city. Well, you know the people in the bar. No, I don't. You have a drink with... Didn't you just have a drink with one of the... Who, who was the person? Mind. Who was the person that gave us that mission to get that? That was Mox. Yeah. Mm. But Something. we told him it was destroyed and gave him yeah. evidence that it was destroyed. Maybe he didn't believe us. But why would he know to raid Tai Lin's safety box? I took the mission. If anything, he would have raided... I look. I'm like, is my is my safety box rated too? Uh, you're you're in office, right? Yeah. Yes. Oh no! Check it. Check it. I I leaf through it, and usually the stuff I keep in here, of course, it are like extra cash. Oh, no. <sighs> club era, like club, files related. Club, club files, yeah, yeah. possible blackmail material. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you leaf through it real quick. Uh, you don't even need to roll. It's all still there. I don't think even the cash. Yeah. I don't think I'm missing anything, Tylen. Yeah, there was some. There was a inform- tracker. A tracker? There must have been. Why else would they know to go straight for your lab and not Damon's office? No, that they, is a good question. They would did I? break in. They did break into Damon's office. And. But they didn't take anything. And how would they have broken into our? offices when exactly did this happen before the shooting started pick uh number one told me they they came in first do we still do do we still ah that does explain the broken nose yeah do we still have footage from all from all your cameras yes we do so i want to take this moment to review security cameras clean no way clean you mean like uh, deleted they hacked it i'm calling razor (laughs) Razor, it's it's too late for this. Are you? Too late. You're, you're a hacker. <laughs> are you? Yeah, I'm awake I'm at night. Hacker. I don't wake up during the day. Do you are look? You see his complexion? Yes. Ty looks were out the window. Oh my night? gosh! What? Where were you last night? Were you at the club last night? No. How yes. No, I was at the club last night. I was when you guys were there, right? Yeah. No, we weren't there because when we rolled up, the whole club got mowed down. By well, automatic what? weapons fire. Wait. The the club. The, yeah, the kill you count. You kind of hear her sit up in bed. What do you mean? The kill count was attacked 
or perhaps we were attacked, but it was outside the kill count by a vehicle mounted minigun. Is anyone, is, is everyone okay? Are you, who? No, many people have died. What about Archie? Archie is unconscious. Oh no. Hang up. What? what, what? <laughs> Redial. <laughs> Listen, I can't get dressed with one hand. We need you here to help go over some footage. I'm on my way. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to send her a text to help go over some footage. <laughs> Just still monologuing over here. Still going in text. There, it's such a I thing love speaker. Oh. I love that we've decided that texting exists in the in the dark future. Yeah, why wouldn't it? Why, why wouldn't it? it? Yeah. Well, uh, it's like right. brain to text messages. Yeah. Hell yeah. You know? Actually, the book gives some reasons why it might not. Yeah. Oh, great. Uh, so where where where's everyone at right now? Actually, um, yeah. Where what are you guys doing? You're still in the office right now. Um. As everybody's medical professional, I say, letting the curtain close on sunlight, I'm going to advise that now would be a good time to get to cover, find somewhere safe, and sleep. Um, before I sleep, is it okay if you take some of these bullets out of my body? Yes, I okay. can absolutely do that. I would really appreciate it. And yes. while that's happening, I'm calling... Wait, do we even have insurance at the... You have to call your boss. <laughs> yeah. I thought Me? you owned this place. I just manage the place. Oh, you're not the owner? Who's your, who's your boss? It's a very good question. We would like to say it's a secret. Oh god, I hate corporations. Somebody who who chooses to remain anonymous. A silent partner, let's say. For the say. sake of... <laughs> well, if you, they you gather... about me, you tell well, them I choose to remain anonymous. Well, the owner's more of a silent partner. Yeah, so the owner, from what you know, is um, somebody who is tied into bigger corporations and wants this part of their endeavors to be kept off their record so they're trying to yeah so they're a bit more anonymous well <laughs> t well tonight since since the place got all shut up uh i guess you is gonna go actually wait no well i, I want to ask akane something she's not awake yet okay well I, i'm gonna so so you is gonna take akane sure. back to her place okay yeah actually as you go down um you when you get down to the main lobby uh you see um at the door walking in in like absolute be bewilderment and like what the fuck is sin nakahara uh mm. and he, when he locks eyes with you uh he's gonna run over to you and kneel and bow and be like master you must teach me your ways <laughs> I, I, I think i've never been defeated so easily and so it's humiliating. I need something to live for. Give me, please, instruct me. You're, you're, you're clearly a master. Uh, Jubei, really? co Jubei continues to walk past him. Master, what? He, he, like, he did like the crawl towards mm -hmm. you. You, what, what must I do? I will stay here. I will wait. What happened here? Uh, Jubei. Jubei uh, grabs two uh, cups of water mm -hmm. and, he, and he puts it in his hands and he says, if you can make it to the Jojo without dropping any water, I'll teach you. He lifts up his mangled hands from your fight yeah. and he's like, where's the dojo? It's about 26 miles that way and you need to get there within uh, 15 minutes. <laughs> That's <laughs> physically impossible. Wait, he didn't say you had to walk, dude. Mm -hmm. I, I'm not there. I'm not yeah, yeah. serious. <laughs> oh. so, are, you, are you serious? Or are you just messing with me? Go. Time's, time's clicking. Okay. He he <laughs> grabs him and he like he like uses his arm to kind of hold him together. And he hits his, his earpiece and he's like, I need a taxi. And he runs outside. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on this guy's side. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, okay, and, and at this point, this is when you, you're going to pick up Akane. She's actually, you're right, She it has been more than 10 minutes, so she mm -hmm. is awake now, and she's kind of just sitting there, um, like, like sh dealing with her own wounds. She, her back is against the bar, and she's just kind of, like, taking in the moment of, like, it's, it's, it was a pretty traumatic mm -hmm. thing, even for a warrior, to 
just have a wall explode towards you <laughs> in bullets. Uh, Sator, how are you feeling? I'm. I've been a lot better. A bit worse though. Did they catch you by surprise? Are they caught? I mean, there's no way to anticipate a hail of bullets coming through a wall. Hmm. I've seen you anticipate a lot of things, though. Not magical. Mm. Yet. Would you? Did you see anybody? Did you see anyone that came in? Uh, just yeah, just a guy earlier that was suspicious. We were all kind of watching him for a minute, especially when he came out of the did office. But that's when things started going down. Did you see anyone from the members of Shockwave? Uh, no. Are you? Are you okay? Yes, but today has been a long day. It looks like it for everyone. May I stay at your place? Uh, that's a little forward. I just need a place to rest. Yeah. All right. And she's gonna get up and like, she's, she's like about to wrap her armor, like hang on you for support, and then she's like, no, I, and okay. and carries herself out. All right. Dubé will rest there for the for the night. Mm -hmm. Cool. Can I get some healing from Ty before my rest? Because I need. Yeah, quite a you few need a lot more. I was looking at how to how to help you recover. Um, Lots of drugs. Yeah, I'm looking at honestly. I'm looking at the pharma, uh, Carlos. If you've got suggestions, uh, there's not because I do get to double what I give you for recovery. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's all you can do right now. Honestly. That's fine. Yeah. I mean. If you if I don't get it all back right now, that's fine. You just get started. Yeah. <laughs> Use lurch. Yeah, where'd the go? Sorry. I don't want I'm any lurch. Well, hey, yeah, have you had any yet? Yeah. No. no. Okay. It's yeah. drug free. There we uh, go. Well, that's happening. I also want to put yeah. in feelers onto the network about information hmm. on um on the kill count hit. Okay. Um give me a Give me, a, give me a connect. Okay. That is an eleven. Okay. Um, there is no on the market hit put out that you can find. <laughs> um, <That's> right. right. <laughs> mm -hmm. But you do actually get different news. Uh, you hear that. Just kind of like the person you're talking to, um, it's kind of just is like casually like, man, did you hear though? Uh, Chrome Union and Ferocity started fighting down south. Uh, okay, that's good to know. There's, it's just, it's all at war between those two right now. So Damon is secretly very smug that their plan to uh, get those two uh, fighting each other has been working. Yeah. Was it your plan? Well, it's more like the team's plan, right? Yeah. And then I also want to put in feelers for that area of the whispers slash the basin and Actually, anything. I'm going to remind you because you because you would know this uh, and it's been a, a couple months since we played. Um, Mox wanted you to frame somebody else. Oh, that's right. <sighs> so. But we're not going to get paid from Mox, I think. Yeah. You know sure, what? You I'm going to call Mox. Okay. And see oh, if he answers. Oh, snap. Okay, so you call Mox. Uh, it rings a couple times and you hear a woman's voice. Hello? Hi, this is Damon looking for Mox. Uh, who? I'm sorry, I think you have the wrong number. I don't think so. I, I, don't, I don't know, Damon. Do you know the kill count? No, never been. And may I ask who I'm speaking to? Julie. Julie. Who are you? Who Dam are you, Damon? You said Damon. That's weird. Okay. Well, sorry. How did you get this number? I've had this number for six years. For six years? Yeah. I see. And Julie, you wouldn't happen to be a corper by any chance? No. I'm a teacher. Oh, very great pro profession, you know. Educate the young ones. Yeah, it's, it's a constant challenge to get them off the streets and keep them on a path of not killing each other, it's rough. So. 
I'm sure it is, Julian. How long have you been a teacher? Uh, basically since I got out of um, school, uh, so 11 years now. 11 years, and you said you had the number for six years. Correct. Well, you know, I guess it must have been a misdial. Apologies for the lateness of the call, and you keep on teaching the future generations not to fight. Thank you. I will. You have a good day, too. Okay, I'm like, that's very interesting. Well, uh, you guys have a lead. Yeah. You sure do. Any our thoughts on the healing? Uh, sure. So I can go ahead and uh, offer you, Brick, a dose of lurch. Okay. Um, so... You don't want... No, I'm just kidding. I'm sorry. Go ahead. You don't want it? No, he was earlier saying, I don't want it. No. Yeah, I mean, I can do a basic first aid with a med kit. I don't think a med kit counts as tech that can't gets you, to double do my both? HP. Uh, that's a good question. There's no reason you can't. We've got I all the don't time in the world here. The only concern would be I'm going to add, that will add system strain. I don't care. To, yeah, okay. He's got a few yeah. space. Yeah, I've, yeah. Only, got I've got two system strains still from when I was homeless. Um, now I have my home back. Yeah, so That's true. You get a nice rest. But my max system strain is 14. I've got plenty of space for more system strain. Uh, and strain. then, Jube, you still have three? No, you have four now, system strain. Yeah. Yeah. Um, previous fight in this one. All right. I will go ahead and I will start with uh, some first aid. Okay. Um, that's a D6. It is indeed a D6. You're holding a D6. Oh, I am holding. Sorry, that's the lurch. Uh, so many Ds. So many Ds. Oh, it's pretty good. So that's a five plus uh, my heal. And that, so that's going to give you six. Okay. A whole six back. Uh, that feels a little better. All right, this so, will help a lot quick, more. Yeah, you're, you're sitting down maybe on a, on a bar stool or something, and you're just healing. Do you guys switch. talk at all while you're doing this, or you kind of have a moment alone? Uh, not right now. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I'm I don't not, have anything to say. I'm not We're very talkative either. Right. Yeah, you're probably tired yeah. as hell. Yeah, this is just kind of going through me patching up brick again. It's not the first time, and I it's like you're good, good to go with this, the lurch. Sure, I've seen that stuff work wonders, I guess. That's going to be nine, and it's going to be doubled, so you're going to get 18 back. Ooh, all right. Nice. So there you go. Take two system wow. strain. That's Thanks, huge. Carlos. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm actually back at full. Wow. Nice. Look at that. That's insane. Way That's to go. Four. Yeah, I use, four system strain I have a minute, and I have a chance to adjust that lurch to uh, match your physiology. I love it. Yeah. And so... Yeah, so you, you're, you're like, physically you feel like you're ready to go again and stuff, and your wounds are all superficial at this point. Nothing deep is remaining. When that is done, I do look to you um, and say, so I think I'm going to need somewhere else to stay for a few days. Could I possibly crash with you uh, if, uh, if it's acceptable to Granda as well? If you are planning to take the queen somewhere else. Um, so Brick will let you stay in the truck with him? Mechanically, mm -hmm. no. There's only living space for one. So, I, I would say you could split it. So instead of the negative two, you each have negative one. Oh, in terms of like our penalty? Strength. You'll take system strength. System strength I'm already at negative one. I, I look around my room <laughs> and I'm like, you know, as, I'm kind of used to. Uh, yeah. As long as you're not living in, like, good conditions, you're taking system strain. Yeah. I already yeah. had a permanent system yeah, strain. Yeah, so if, if you guys, I would say, club. yeah, I would say you would each just take one instead of two. All right, we can do that. It's okay with okay. me. So what, how do you guys fit in there? It's, it's a bed. Uh, I will, yeah, so what gonna I'm going to do <laughs> is... Uh, Brick will sleep on the roof. Pack up. Okay, no, 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 I can, I'll, I'll take the floor. Ty will offer to take the floor. Ty's going to grab their bedding and a pillow as well as all of their, their files out of the safe. Pack it all up and and all their medicines too. So this entire mm -hmm. living quarters is like in this section that's over the cab? Mm, oh, it's one of those. Yeah, so we're not like... Them. Okay. Uh, it's not like, oh, I'll take the floor. I'm going to sleep on the roof. 
Uh, no, I, I got it. You should rest. I. It, however you guys do it. Okay. Yeah, we we, we cut on minutes. us arguing yeah, yeah. about who's going to sleep where. Yeah, we cut out. Um, <laughs> anyone doing anything else tonight? Today. Drinking. All right. So... I bring the I grab the the bathtub do you, vodka. Do you stay in the um in the vicinity or do you drive somewhere else to to sleep? So until this happened, my reason for even being in Midlight City was over, mm-hmm. right? Because I got Granda back. Yep. Um so I I don't know where else to go in the city. Uh I'm not going to I'm not going to just take Ty out of town if she doesn't want to go. Or if they don't want they to go, don't. but um, I don't know where to go, so I guess I'll just stay here. Okay, unless Ty has somewhere to recommend. Um, yeah, unless there's some place you want to go, Ty. Uh, can I roll a no check? Sure. To yeah, I don't have the uh, find a find a place to live, uh, find a hidey hole, <laughs> uh, focus or actually, sh- you did as a notice. A notice check. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so that's gonna be a uh, is uh, eight. Okay, you do see um, Akane and... Or eleven. Ju- oh, even better. Yeah, you do see Akane and Jubei walking out of the club uh, towards wherever they're going to go stay. Oh, okay. So, um, I'll catch up with if, them? If you wanted to, you guys can... Well, I'm thinking probably dispersing. Honestly, that wouldn't be my first... My first thought would be, let's disperse. Oh, okay. And that, uh, yeah, in that case, if you eat... Um, you know a lot of places. There's... Yeah. I have a lot of friends. Actually, yeah, there is the... You do know a couple of other doctors or mm-hmm. medics. Um, you can pick one of them to go stay by. If you oh. wanted. All right, sure. Um, either way, yeah, you, you can easily find somewhere else to go. Yeah, I'll just, you know, f- I'll pick whichever one has a, w- a convenient uh, truck stop nearby them where Queen Granda can blend in a little bit. Okay. Not much, but... Uh, I mean, the city is in rubble and ruins. Almost. No. I mean, not quite rubble ruin, but like, it wouldn't be hard for you to just park anywhere in Blenheim. Okay, I will, before I leave, text you to let you know, hey, going with Brick, gonna stay in the truck overnight. We'll, uh, we'll text me if you hear anything. Thank you. Roger that. Cool. And then what are you saying tonight? Um, well, I normally also stay at the club, Mm -hmm. but you know what? I'm probably going to be just sleeping in my office chair. Okay. Um, Or like a cot. I'll probably just pull a cot into my office. That's fine. That's good enough. Uh, Mm -hmm. at least for one night, you can do that. Without Mm -hmm. assistance, Shane. Cool. So you guys rest for the night. Um, uh, Akane doesn't want to do anything or go to bed or like talk or anything. She's just, she's ready. Mm -hmm. She's tired and wants to go to bed. Um, so you guys sleep. You wake up the next morning, uh, yeah, to the, the world as is. We get any HP while, while sleeping? Yes. Uh, it's your level yep. in HP, so five. Okay, I check messages from, say, um, the owner about getting things checked out of the building, rebuilt, recleaned. You check messages, or do you call the owner? Um, probably leave a message for the owner. Okay, what do you say? I'm like, bar got shot up. Needs there's structural damage. Needs <laughs> checking and clean up. Mm-hmm. Well, clean up out handle, but the structural damage will need the owner's buy-in. Okay, uh, so it's not right away, but eventually, no. It's pretty, it's, yeah, it's pretty close to right away. <laughs> you just get one word back. Disappointing. I'm like, I know. That's all you get from them. For now. What are you guys doing? Day's yours. This is the next day now? It is the next day. Well, I was gonna go ahead and blow town, but, um... I gotta be honest, I'm not too happy about Damon's club getting shot up. I'm sorry, what happened to your prisoner? Oh, oh we yeah. put him on well, ice, didn't we? still 24 hours. I mean, he's still out cold. Yeah, he's still out, but where did you just leave him in the office with you? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Great, okay, cool. I'm putting him downstairs, yeah. yeah. <laughs> do, you, do you want me to take you somewhere? Or? Um, I'll... 
uh, take a minute to think about that. And like, honestly, uh, nowhere in this city. I. Well, you want to join the clan? <laughs> Me and Jim, we're getting a clan together. <laughs> you know, I might. Uh, I'm getting real close to taking you up on that, Brick. But. And I'm going to, because I grabbed my files, and I think I grabbed my cash as well, and I am only at... Caches. Caches. I grabbed my caches as well, and I am also around 15k, and I look at it, I'm like, can't leave yet. There's, there's this stuff I have to take care of before I go. We were also supposed to get paid for that job we got shot at for, right? Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen. We're going to have to hunt down the right guy. There. You're not there. Oh, shoot. But yeah. <laughs> you can just call us. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> anyway, I actually was going to say, I am going to call you just to make sure. It, I didn't ask you where you were at, so I'm going to call you and make sure you're still alive. Hey. Hey, morning, Tylin. How are you? Uh, Been better, but better than yesterday. Um, are you still are you still at the club? Yeah, lots of things to do here to fix. Hey, by the way, I tried calling Mox. You what? Yeah, I thought it would be give it a shot, but of course the number was as I suspected, spoofed. Lady answered the phone. Apparently she had that number for the last six years. Um, you got did a, um, Razor ever show up? I was literally just going to say, okay. yeah, you got texts um, late, like mid, late night um, that she showed up to the, the okay. club. So what I would have said, and I would have mm -hmm. kept you in the loop as well, I contacted Razor to scrub that footage and see if it had been altered. No, the footage is gone. Oh, you said the footage was clean. Yeah, a cl like, it, like it was gone. It was cleaned out, sorry. Oh, yeah. well, that, that I forgot being, a word. Okay, that being yeah. the case, um, then I would, the next thing would be to trace that phone line. Well, so you did get a text, mm -hmm. by the way, uh, yeah. in the middle of the night. And it was Razor saying, you guys fucking left Archie here in this table by himself he wasn't by himself there was hundreds of people there yeah but you oh yeah she she just responded yeah but you were friends his friends look gender pronouns are hard the best i can do is my truck is my lady it was autocorrect fuck you and then she's like <laughs> <laughs> and then you get a text message from damon saying by the way can you check down this number then you give mock mm -hmm. or her mox's number okay uh, she's like, yeah, I'll look into it, whatever. And It's for Archie. I will look into it. I'm looking over your shoulder as you have this conversation, and I text you, hey, can you go down to my clinic and check on Archie? Will do. By the way, I still have the, um, prisoner. Oh, yeah. Are we going <laughs> to eat that guy, or what? That was a joke, Ty. I was like, this is why people don't like Outlanders. No, that was a joke. I, that was, I'm leaning into the stereotype. Mm -hmm. g joins in on the, on the call. This is a group chat. Yeah, yeah. No, this is <laughs> a group yeah. chat. Group chat's blowing up this yeah. morning. All right. g how's your girlfriend? Wait, do you do you guys hit the, the same um, uh, group chat with Razor, or do you actually start? Yes. You know, Okay. Razor, oh, it's Razor yeah, in the group chat. Yeah, she was in your last group chat. Razor's so one yeah, of the Yeah. Yeah, this is just, yeah, she she reaches out to you. Uh, that makes sense. She would reach out to you. On the, yeah. Jube doesn't acknowledge that. And then he says, I will look into that noodle place. Well, you know, Brick has a car. It's a little uh, conspicuous, but. What do you mean by that? If, if, we, if he takes that. That thing, your lady is very attention worthy well that's for damn sure they'll see us coming a mile away uh well, that's for damn sure right away <laughs> what uh, uh we can keep playing okay this. sorry i'll look it up but um we should uh if anyone wants to accompany me oh uh, that's when i'm gonna head first i actually do kind of want to come with you but i need to do something with what was his name again Archie? No, I need to check. I do need to check on Archie, but on the prisoner's name. Totally. Rick. 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 <laughs> yeah. Rick. Yeah, yeah, you know, like Damon's not good with the number. Damon's not good with names. 
which is funny because it's your profession. <laughs> uh, I mean, you, you're sitting next to him pretty much, so unless you put him somewhere else. Yeah, you know what? I think I'm going to... Um... He's like... You want to bring him along? He's just a lump of dough right now. You know what? Can't hurt. Let's bring him along. Okay. So you check on Archie first, I assume. Mm -hmm. uh, when you go down there... Uh, uh, just throw him in the trunk. Razor is actually <laughs> sitting next to him and waiting. And she's like, is that normal for them to, to be out this long? I thought... He seems okay, right? Yeah, he should have woken up. <laughs> <I can't believe. laughs> well, you know, Tylen checked on him and... No, we're talking about Archie now. Yeah. Oh, of course. Not the... Tylen did check on him and yeah. said that Archie would be fine. So he's just probably getting all his Z's in. She hits him, you big baby. Wake up. <laughs> and uh... and then I look at Razor. I'm, I'm not going to see any photos of, of Archie online, are Am I? She starts deleting stuff. No. Because okay. <laughs> <laughs> if you Why would are, I take pictures, pictures of him. Because he's, if you are, he's beautiful. You know, I take commission. I, I, I don't need. I don't. I don't want to take photos of him. All why, right. Why would you even ask that? It's not like I like him or anything. He's just here. I'm. I'm pretty to look at, right? Yeah, he's very pretty to look at. Okay, I admit it. But... You know, he's genetically modified to be the perfect human. So what? He's. Beautifully genetically modified. Yeah. You could be ugly genetically modified. Have you seen some of those rhinoceros dudes? Listen, I don't think you want to have that deep of a conversation with me about it. All I'm saying you got, is... You're all getting this one. <laughs> yeah. 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 And I'm like, are you all texting Brick while you're talking to me, Razor? We understand yes. why you want to bounce on his pogo stick. I take your phone away from you. <laughs> <laughs> um, like, any, hey, any I word... you fix Kronda? <laughs> He took some damage. Um, no, well, yeah, that would be great. Yeah, do you have a tool rack? Uh, I do. I've already repaired three of Granda's hit points. Um, I will roll up my sleeves and get to work as well. Any information on that phone number, by any chance? Oh, what, you think I can just sit here and hack with my phone? Yeah, yeah, you're very good. Okay, I can, you're right. Uh, n nothing yet so far. It's... There's it's a it's a trace it's like tracing a maze. There's a relay after relay after relay. How good was this cleanup job? Like super professional as or as good as it gets. There's nothing better. How could Shockwave have that good of a hacker? They are corporate. They're the, one of the big five. Seven. Big seven. Yeah, I text back, they absolutely have that good of a hacker. And probably They better. probably have a whole room of them. Yeah. I'm you know, me They're hacking. Enormous. I might run into one of them and then they'll know who I am and then I'm gonna get a minigun in my house and then it's gonna come on me. So whoever did the job is someone super highly skilled. Which alright. Good to know. Thanks, Razor. Text text the group if you find out anything else. Yeah. I text directly to you. And as I'm watching this all go down. I'm like, Archie's still and... unconscious. I, I, yeah. I, I say, oh. I say, well, well, let's not forget that one of the the guy who was operating the gun, he did get away. So he does know about the truck. Mm. So if he sees, he's probably, he's probably told his associates about it already. He knows that at least Brick is alive. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So... Might not be the best to take that thing around. No. I wanted you to snipe him so bad. <laughs> <laughs> unless you can, I wanted him. Unless wanted you can him. change entirely how that truck looks. Or we just take a cab down. Mm -hmm. I will text directly to you. There was stuff in my safe that would have been of interest to a corporation. If they, this was highly targeted just on the thing we took from their aircraft. So probably definitely Archie related. Uh, before we move on to, I wanna actually go to um, Jubei and Akane. When you wake up, she's already up, her arms in a sling that she did herself. And uh, she's doing it with her other hand, she's like making breakfast. Yeah, Jubei's doing his morning routine. Uh, uh. Uh, you sleep in. I sleep in? Yeah, no, no, like, she's, she's telling you that you slept in. Oh, okay. 
Oh, that's not like me. I need to... Like, Jimmy instantly starts, like, doing his, mm. like, 100 push-ups and 100, uh, sit-ups. <laughs> <laughs> still doing 100? And a 10K run. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> 10K run, yeah. She knows. I know where yeah. the... I kind of, like, you're still only doing 100? Well, I did get injured, so... Yeah, that's true. Well, hopefully your insurance, like, gives you, like, some barely made eggs mm -hmm. that are, like, okay. This will help, I hope. They're <laughs> barely yeah. made. Uh, not a cook. <laughs> like, you don't have any uh, sake left, do you? I stopped drinking a while ago. Well, I made some mistakes when I was intoxicated in the past. Anyway, uh, your phone was buzzing all night. It was? Yeah, it woke me up uh, like three times. Jimmy checks it. Uh, at, a, at like... 14 minutes and 59 seconds and <laughs> is outside of the location. Uh, ha like taxi cab mm. dude took the picture for him, obviously. And it's like time stamped and he's like holding the glass of water. And then he's like, paying me now? And then like an hour later, master? <laughs> and like an hour later, master, will you train me please? I succeeded in your task. Um, g is gonna check the camera on his phone that's hooked up to the camera from the dojo. Is he outside? Yeah, he's still outside. Okay. There's is your he, henchman. Is he still <laughs> is he still holding on to the one? Uh uh no, he set him down, but okay. they're still near him. Alright. He's just like he is actually sitting on How your doorstep. Did he set them down? Mm. He's he, he holds them like this. He yeah. put him down with his arms. But right, he's sitting so on the No, no. So he's <laughs> he's sitting on um on your doorstep, uh like in a meditative stance or sit okay. position. He really says, well, He'll be like, right there for a while. <laughs> yeah, Jibri says uh, to Akani, well, I'm going to have to go check on this kid. Your fingerless student. Oh, what kid? Chin. Oh, um, why? I thought you, didn't you like break his hands or something? Yeah, but he has some spunk in him. Kind of reminds me of me when I was young. Are you allowed to train someone when you're not a master? I thought you said I was a master. You're you're skilled enough to be a master, but you still have another step to becoming a master. Um, can yeah, I like, like, so, oh, oh. can I, I your fictional thing, whatever. In most real world martial arts, there is a level where you're allowed to train people that is not at black belt. Like you can start before that. <laughs> it's good. Isn't it different. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but um but Jubei says Kane I was defeated on the, on the last mission I almost took my own life but then I realized from the people I was with that not all defeats are created equal why do you think I didn't kill myself when you saved me Because we still have each other, right? We're friends. <laughs> <laughs> Shut down. Take a hit point. <laughs> <laughs> Emotional damage. Damn. But, but Jube says, but th that just showed me that I have, there's reasons why I still walk this earth. So might as well train this kid a little bit. Yeah. Don't let Master know. Everybody's got a boss except me. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> you technically have a boss. J Jubei says, and then, uh, Your mother. Master has a problem with it. <laughs> I quit that job. If, if, master, if Master has a problem with it, he can take it up with me. Mm. And then Jubei You've kind changed of, too. He picks up his sword and slides it, and he says, Penny to the Jojo. Well, Come back in one piece. He just leaves. <laughs> Excellent. Mm -hmm. Oh. Mm -hmm. I'm tied to the mm -hmm. ground. Or on my wheel. I think I'm on my wheel. If, if you want, I can fast forward to the dojo. Yeah, let's and, do that. And I, and I pick up Shin. Okay. And, uh, I, and I tell him, from now on, he has to follow me wherever I go. I, <laughs> eat what you eat, do eat, what you yeah, do. Yeah, yes. eat what I eat, do what I do. Uh, train, he's, uh, train exactly the way I train. He lights up. He's ecstatic. Um, should I should I call you? What should I call you? Should I call you master? Just 
Master Jubei is fine. Master Jubei, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, Master Jubei. Mm -hmm. Anything you want. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, do you guys all meet up? Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah. And now Shin's with me. Great. And you're taking mm -hmm. the, you're leaving the truck and taking a taxi or? Well, no, I have a driver truck. that's, um, I can make our prisoner be our driver if Brick doesn't want to go. Do you have no, I'm, I'm going. You're going. You still have. For one thing, Mox owes me money. You also have like 12 mm -hmm. hours before that guy wakes up. Yeah, that's yeah. true. Brick is very low on funds. Do we uh, rent a car? I was going to say steal a car. What's wrong with my car? It's not. They, they, they know how it looks. Uh... Are we trying to be? <laughs> are, we trying... are we trying to go in secret? They shot at us. They know we're coming for them. Well, they don't know that we got the, a location from the driver. This yeah. is hopefully not. Yeah. Uh, they'll see us a mile away. You know, it's in the wild when you ambush people or ambush predator prey. I don't ambush people. Ambush prey? Well, that's not true. I would All right, like, fine. I was going to say, I would like to use that incredible role that I got on this location to think of a place, think of a route in to the noodle, towards the noodle shop, where we could take Granda, of, take back roads, park Granda maybe a half mile away, and hoof it the last 50, you know, the last half mile without anybody where you know short of them having an actual like guard up around the whole I would area it's survival uh okay. because it's more of a, um, a street smart type of thing if okay. worse comes to worse we could wake up the driver and have him take us you through can, shortcuts sure. i mean if you can wake him up ahead of time pretty good de-drug him all right can i add my intelligence bonus to yes. this okay so that's gonna be oh I I i'm refilling my fingers by the way we could also have any of the club full of yeah, mercenaries can, drive us over there. yeah that's true that is well, true yeah do you oh. need me to do that for you do i i did, no, I did. it's not clean clear hmm i did miss a beat um as you're leaving breaker does approach you uh damon and he's like we're putting a gang together to go after whoever did this. You know, we're still looking for information because I think the person who did it doesn't really exist. Some of us... We're looking for a location. Can't wait for information. We're just going to hit the streets and start looking around, knocking on doors, kicking suit. That's, that's great. We've well, got information yeah. gatherers. you got my there. number, right? Of course. Good. Let us know. and We'll so, keep you posted, too. So we... Yeah. So Breaker walks out with a bunch of K-pop style cat girls. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. They're like, yeah. And, uh, <laughs> which, which one are they? Uh, the uh, cat claws. Cat claws and Breaker. Yeah. Breaker's one person? Yeah. Breaker's one dude. Okay, Breaker's okay. one person. Yeah. And he was your number Breaker one the until claws. last update. That's right. The blue, yeah. coat, oh. blue coats bumped him down. Okay. Oh, VIP's yeah, dead. That's right. So, wait, yeah. yeah, but we haven't updated. It's still like the same day that we found that out. Yes, yeah, exactly. Yeah. So. Uh, but Breaker and Akane are the only individuals on the board, right? Uh, yeah. The VIP, VIP. Yes. He's dead. Yeah, he's dead. Yeah. So, the he's only surviving individuals in the top 10 are Akane yeah. and Breaker. And there is one other. Punchline? No, Punchline. Oh, no, no. Punchline is a bunch of murder clowns. That's right. <laughs> Sorry, the Jokers. Yeah. Uh, got was, it. Was Shadow, Death, Chaos, or the Jugglers, a Storm in the, the kill count at the time? No, they were not. Okay. Yeah. Okay. They're never around they when you out. need them. Yeah. They've, they've been in there before. You guys have seen them. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. right. So we're where? heading there. Let's do it. Let's go. Um, Who you haven't get... yet is Alpha, Alpha hmm? the Alpha Bro Squad. The Alpha Bro Squad. <laughs> yeah. Um, I, I actually uh, beg Matt to swap Alpha Bro Squad with another group just so they'd be in the top 10 on so, the And, and there's a reason board. they weren't there today uh, or yesterday. Uh, there was three injuries in their last job, so they are mm. on hiatus for a mm. week. Okay. Mm. Uh, can we get someone from the club to drive us? That's probably, I feel like that's the simplest thing to do. Uh, uh, waffles. 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 Pixel Pirates. My, they're, they're my best, yeah, waffles. My, best yeah. Waffle. my son was asking me yesterday, what's the point of waffles? What's he about? He was, <laughs> was just a guy I needed information from. The waffles part of the story is yeah. over. But now he's back. <laughs> he's a recurring character. Hell yeah. yeah. Waffles. You and me, same team, 
Starting now. Uh, yeah, what is that supposed to mean? We need a ride. Uh. Uh. You want to get the guys that shot up the club? Yeah. That's what we're like, after. Like everybody here. That's what we're after, too. But if we take my lady over there, um, we're afraid they're going to see us coming. By the way, um, a few other people have added their names to the bounty, and it's gone up another 5,000. Oh, very nice. Okay. So 20,000. 20,000, yep. Okay. Uh, so uh, Waffles, his, some of his guys were injured, uh, so he's like, you guys, you guys are going to be okay. All right, good. Just stay low, stay covered. I'm going to go with these guys. Let's see what, what I can do to help. Waffles, we really appreciate you throwing in for the community. Hey, man. Like, this is nuts, man. Uh, can we just... That's right. You know what? Out in the... Out in the... The, the uh, scorched lands. I used to have, uh, like, a clan that I was in, and I haven't really had that before since I left my clan because they all kind of hated me. But now that I've got That's this... That's all very good. And we have plenty... Let's just drive. drive. Yeah, okay. Uh, so... For anyone, just so you guys all know what it looks like, uh, Waffles is part of uh, Pixel Pirates, and they're like glam rock pirates. Like, oh yeah, yeah. That's so cool. he's Love he's it. kind of shiny, uh, but he's like totally willing to come, <laughs> and he's definitely on something. <laughs> after last night, he's been up all night, and you can see it in his eyes. <laughs> uh, great. Yeah. So he Let's uh, go. he yeah he you guys hop in his car, which is like okay, like a fifties um. Uh, what's the 50s car with the fins on the sides? Like, just a convertible. Oh, um, like a big Cadillac? Like, yeah, yeah, big Cadillac yeah. type of thing. Uh, so he, yeah, they're, he's driving one of those convertible. Um, there's like uh, uh, PP in, in rhinestones on the hood and stuff. And so, yeah, he, he, he rolls up and it, it sounds good. Like, it's got a really deep roar to it. And he's like, you guys ready? You guys ready? Yeah. And like, oh, we're going to toss this one in, in your trunk. Yeah. That's great, because I don't have room for him up front. Yeah. I assume we're talking about the prisoner and not Archie. Yeah, yeah. the prisoner. Okay. Now, Archie can stay in here. <laughs> Razor's watching over him. Yeah, Razor would we're, yeah, We should we? bring Archie with us, so that when Max comes back next week and we're still <laughs> on Archie, he can wake up. <laughs> or, or Razor. We, we probably need a hacker. We will need Razor. Awesome. We can stay... How about this? We stay connected virtually to Razor and leave her here with Archie. And when wherever when they we wake get, up, they can dual hack for when us. they when they wake up, they uh, they can flip for who's gonna drive and who's gonna uh, you know hack en route. Uh, um, I um I think Razor would stay. Okay. I think it would stay with Archie there. Okay. Um, uh, and I'm not just saying that for story or for inconvenience. I'm saying more. Like yeah. She would. She just wants to take care of him. Uh, great. So you guys drive. Uh, it's very uneventful. Very. Other than at one point on the drive, you hear a ridiculous amount of gunfire in the distance, and uh, and uh, Waffles is like, "Oh man, yeah, they're probably shooting at each other again." The gangs, man, it's like gang World War a million out here. Yeah. Waffles, what gangs are fighting? It's the Chrome Union and uh, Ferocity. Oh yeah, those guys hate each other lately. They were fine yeah. for years. Like it was, a, it was like a gang peace for a while. Right, but then one of them killed one of the other one's guys, and you never know what sets these things off. It's a fragile ecosystem we live Died in. Died in the yeah, bathroom, sure I heard. Yeah. <laughs> you see the rat and trust running over. Yeah. Hey, man, <laughs> you want to leave those things alive? They take care of the bugs for you. I missed anyway. They're, I never get them. Mm -hmm. Uh. They don't eat. Bugs. Rats eat everything. That's true, but they're not really a bug the, the type. elimination. <laughs> uh, I just sort of trail <laughs> off. Tyler, <laughs> 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 are you all right? <laughs> Love it. Uh, great. So you guys, are you going to the noodle place or the, uh, the apartment first? The apartment. Yeah. Yeah. Although I'm texting um, Thailand. By the way, anything you want to share I'm in those in files of yours? With you, right? But. It's a yeah, private. we're all in the car we're together. In, oh, oh it's but private? She, you're texting. Yeah. What but I'm like, by the way, anything interesting in those files you want to share? Um, I get the message. Blocked. Just, <laughs> <laughs> I just give you a side eye and put my phone away without responding. I knew that was how it she would, how they would respond. They, yeah. uh, awesome. You guys pull up on a rather generic looking apartment building it's like eight stories tall um it's very old so it's more concrete and brick 
Um, but it hasn't been painted or changed in, since even before the volcano, so it's probably got layers of all kinds of shit on it. Um, there's a double door in the front, and up a couple steps. Can I just park up front? Like, uh, yeah. Yeah, why not? My truck is the one that they know, so, you know, I don't think, do you, do you have any reason to think they'd recognize this car? Nope. And then why not? Okay. Yeah, he, ro he rolls up to the front and, like, he kind of, like, hits the curb on one wheel and kind of, like, straightens it into a, a, a parking, yeah. job, a rough parking. Like, he parks fine, but the the getting into that spot was weird. Did he the hit the bumpers? Bumper <laughs> car? Uh, no. Uh, well, does he go up some on low the curb? Taps he, he, he goes up on the curb for a second yeah. and rolls back off. Yeah. There you are. Excellent driving, Waffles. Please give me a good rating. What? You, you do this professionally? Now? Sure. Great rating. Thanks. Did you get, give him some points on the, the leaderboard? Yeah. We'll set up later. Heck yeah. All right. Waffles, we really appreciate it. Should I come in? Pull out a revolver? like a. We like might a... need a getaway driver and you get, someone needs to watch the guy in the trunk. Yeah, did, did you know we put a guy in your trunk? I did, no. Yes. Okay. Yeah, so you were pretty loud about that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Yeah, keep keep the engine warm. Okay, okay. Well, hey, do you guys want to hit before you go in? No, what definitely it? not. Uh, it's like, who knows? <laughs> I probably know. Oh. Can I roll? <laughs> Damon's like, was your mouth on this? Is that a heal or a no? <laughs> what? I've got a contact high already, so we're all right. Okay, Thanks. all right, all right. Is this a heal or a no? To uh, recognize either, the either or, yeah. I'm gonna do heal. Okay. Bonus dice. Oh man, why am I rolling terribly today? So that's just gonna be um, five plus the four, so nine. So it's in a generic pipe, so it's kind of hard to tell. No. It could be any number of things, but it's definitely a stimulant. You can catch a whiff. Yeah. Mm, yep. No, no, thank you. All right. No. Well, good luck, guys. No, you should take that. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Once you said stimulant, I was like, yeah, well, yeah. Rick needs that. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's it's essentially like a smokable cocaine. Okay. Uh. <laughs> well, guys, let's go in there! <laughs> yeah, that was probably really loud. Sorry, guys. <laughs> let's find out right, who we... shut up our place! I'm going to go in. Are there any, like, windows or, like, back doors to this entrance? Uh, so the ground floor, the entrance is two double doors. There are, like, windows into the apartments and stuff on the ground floor they're all boarded up or barred up or like you know all kinds of weird makeshift defenses that people put on from living in a really shitty part of town for a long time mm -hmm. you want me to take some of these boards off <laughs> you know why not you guys are going to go through someone's apartment okay well we got to find uh, out who lives here don't we maybe we should maybe i can just go up and knock on the door oh there's a door yeah yeah oh that's a better idea so yeah it's the fourth floor by the way yeah, I look, I look around at these. I don't look the least threatening. Let's be real. You maybe, but no, nah, it's Damon's probably the me. most threatening. Yeah. How about what's what is our plan here exactly? Do we we just kind of we retro that we came up with a plan? <laughs> <by> the <way? laughs> I'm going in. Uh, in. Yeah, you have the front doors. There's a lobby. Uh, the doors. We're locked, but you have no problem just kind of breaking it open. Okay. Uh, lobby, mailboxes to your left, a uh, bunch of garbage to your right, some vomit on the floor. Damon's going to stay Stairs in front of you. outside downstairs to see if anyone is going to escape or run yeah. out. Well, so there's as you walk in the lobby, there's the stairs in front of you and to the, the your right of the stairs is a hallway going to like the back door of the building. Mm. But we know that we're going to the fourth floor. Yes. So I will go for the stairs then. I'm just letting you know on the back doors. Yeah, that's not going to come in handy later. Um, oh, maybe next week, though. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm going up to four. Okay. Uh, just by yourself? I mean, am go I home? going by myself? No, you no, guys no. are all dithering out front. Stop yeah. dithering. Dithering. <laughs> Dither. No, 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 no Jubei's going to come inside. All right, now I'm safe. Okay. Damon's going to wait by the back door. Damon's intimidating in a whole different way than you and me. I will set myself up by the front door. Like, 
you see us and you're like, oh no, he's going to beat me up. And you see Damon, you're like, oh no, he's going to buy my family. <laughs> cool. So yeah, you go up, uh, there's a door. There's better return on investment that way. Yeah. Hmm. No answer. Mm. Uh, it's a, yeah, you break it pretty easily. It's not armored. It's not like ripping a, a gun off a mount. Oh. No, yeah, you, you <laughs> tore a minigun off of a truck earlier. I feel like this door is no, no challenge. We're gonna... Uh, yeah, you, you, so you walk in, or you open the door. Um, pretty basic slum apartment. Um, like a mattress on the ground. Pile of bottles and food in the corner. And, um, like half of a couch. Uh, does this drug I'm on allow me to read still? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it doesn't really do anything okay. negative. Because I'm just saying, I'm going through whatever papers are left here. I'm searching. Uh, I'm searching uh, so you're in the living room right now. There's a hallway, or yeah, a little hallway to the to your right, um, going right. All right, I'll go through the hallway. Yep. Awesome. I'll go behind him for backup. There's a door to your right in the hallway and a door straight ahead. It's a very short hallway too. Uh. Dube, when you go through the doors, take a knee, and I can shoot over you if there's someone in there. I will right, we'll do the one on our right first. All right, let's go. Okay, it's like heavy pistol. Yeah, yeah I, I hit open. I I kneel down. So you guys, you guys kick, you like kick yeah. it open. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, great. So you kick the door open, and uh, immediately you have a gun in your face as well. Mm -mm. And what you see before you is a man in like tactical armor, like like makeshift kind of put together tactical armor and a like police badge that's kind of like a fabric um hmm. not kind of not like a real badge it's, it's like a police badge uh he's wearing a helmet and have, cowboy boots have we ever seen a police badge before uh <laughs> if you lived before the volcano eruption yes i you, well, you probably not, not wasn't it like our grandparents time when that no happened? that was only like 20 that was only like 30 years ago Okay. So can we tell years? if this is like an official uniform? Uh, there is. Okay, so a little bit of lore for the the city because you all know this. There is no official police force anymore after the collapse. Um, the mm -hmm. gangs and corporations took over each individual uh, district or created their own districts, mm -hmm. uh, fought for their own districts, and they each have their own armies or police forces or militias. But the existing police kind of held out for a while and try to hit, hold on to law and order. Um, but slowly they joined mercenaries like the, the blue coats or they got killed or they quit. Mm -hmm. uh, you haven't, but you've seen, you probably haven't seen like an actual active duty police officer in at least 10 years. Does he, does he say anything? Yes. And we'll find out next time. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. I, I know who it is, but we did set up specifically to shoot people who were threats as we were coming through the door. So we have to start next session with me shooting him. <laughs> that's that's your prerogative. That's okay. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, that's going to be uh, interesting to find out what happens to next. Uh, yep. Uh, next week, a week we might coming. actually kill another play mm -hmm. character immediately. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks we'll for find watching. Out. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Thanks for the raid. Led yeah, the that was conference. awesome. Uh, we still have 32 viewers following. Hey, hey okay. it. Also, for Taters, oh, thank Carlos you. Carlos in the chat the whole time helping yes. with the rules. Yes. Does Brick go? <laughs> <the couple? laughs> <laughs> Next week, yeah, we'll find out. Uh, we really appreciate everyone. If you like the show, give us a follow here on Twitch. Come by Maybe on Monday. a sub. There's And go sub on YouTube as well. Mm -hmm. uh, links in the chat. Yeah. Appreciate you guys. We'll see you on Monday for the finale of Call of Cthulhu. Yep. And then back yes. here on Friday for more of this. Yeah, and this is only, what, our fifth, fourth? Six. Sixth episode of uh, of Midlight City. So all you can get caught up on, on all of our back episodes yeah, on YouTube. Yeah, it only take you, like, Hours. They're, three, they're three hours each, and okay, there's so five eight, of them, yeah. so yeah, a mere 15, hours. 15 hours of content to get all caught up. You, could you, skip, guys, yeah. you guys binge The Witcher. You could skip the intro, you can skip the cre the. Yeah, yeah. I, just, I, I just see watch you next it at time. 10 speed. Don't skip the credit. <laughs>